Hello guys, welcome back to my channel Osprey Gaming, and today we are going to upgrade something cool. First off all as you can see, we have upgraded everything we have turned. This house from looking into this, to this, but we have never ever once upgraded our car. So today we are going to upgrade Franklin's car, and to do that we need money, but unfortunately Franklin has none. He is left with zero penny in his account, but we will earn some cash before the end of the day, and Franklin and Benjamin are going to make sure of that. So without ado, let's hear it from Franklin and Benjamin. Dad, you are really the best! Man, I'm so pumped up for this upgrading! This is going to be fun for sure! They never grow up. They still act like some kids. I can expect that coming from Benjamin, but from Franklin, not so sure about it. Oh, well, this Grand Theft Auto 6 trailer is just awesome! Oh, yeah, baby, I just love it! So, Dad, what are we gonna do? We don't have any money! How are we going to upgrade our house? Yeah, I know Benjamin. We have zero penny left, man. That sucks. But don't worry, we will earn some money before the end of the day. First, let's go to Trevor and try lending some money from him. I'm sure he won't deny me. After all, he's a good friend of mine. Oh, uh, yes! To Uncle Trevor's place, then we go! Man, I just love that old man. I'm sure he will help you. Yeah, of course he will. All right, as you can see, guys, Franklin has decided to lend some money from Trevor for his car upgrading. So let's see you what's see gonna happen that? next. Uh-oh. Man, just look at Trevor's house. He has really changed everything. Man, this looks really amazing. I just love it. Hey there, tough guy. No sugar. Hey, Trevor, my homie. How you doing? By the way, Trevor, can you please lend me some money? You see, I'm upgrading my car, but to do that, I need money. And at the moment, I'm broke. So it would be nice if you lend me some cash. I promise I will return you back later. Heck, I will return you with interest. Yeah, Uncle Trevor, Dad is right. Give us a job that pays us good or lend us some money. Come on, Trevor, pretty please. Oh, I'm so sorry, guys. You see, I sold my club to Lester, and that's is how I got this money to upgrade my house. I spent it all of it in building this house, and at the moment, I just have $1,000 left. Yeah, all right, Trevor, homie. Sorry for bothering you anyway. All right, Benjamin, let's go, son. Sorry for disappointing you, too. I really am. Hope you understand, Franklin. Yeah, we understand, dog. Well, anyway, goodbye, Trevor. See you later, homie. Yeah, goodbye, Franklin and Benjamin. So what now, Dad? Where do we go now? He was our best option. Just give me a minute, Benjamin. Let me remember some folks who should have a better job. Where should I go? Ah, uh, come on! Why isn't anything coming in my mind? Oh, wait a minute. Hold on, I got a guy. He surely must have a good job for us. And that's my former boss, Simeon. I'm so sorry, Franklin. As of now, I don't have any jobs for you. And I don't have enough money that I can lend you as well. You see all those cars? It's right there from one week. No one has purchased a single car. I don't know why business ain't going well from past few days. So I'm sorry, Franklin. Hope you understand it, buddy. Yeah, all right, dog, uh -huh. I understand. Sorry for bothering you anyway. I better get going. Simeon, see you later, dog. Yes, yeah, see you later, Franklin. So what's the deal, father? What did Uncle Simeon had to say? Don't tell me he didn't have any jobs or money either. Yeah, Benjamin, you are right. He doesn't have anything that he can offer. Now we don't have many options left. Lamar is out of town. We just had your uncle, Mike. He is our last resort. If he doesn't have anything to offer, then we will have to wait for the upgrade. Man, that just sucks. All right, kid, here you go. Oh man, thanks, dog. Oh, hell yeah. I knew that you wouldn't disappoint us. Man, you are the best uncle, Mike. I really love you. Yeah, that's cool, ain't that right, Benjamin? Hey, Franklin, by the way, I need a job to be done by you. Don't think that it's for the money. Just do this as a favor for me. Oh yeah, anything for you, my dog. Just tell me what kind of favor do you need from us? You see? Oh man, how do I put this? See, Franklin, I need you to knock some shit into Jimmy. He is really acting tough from few days. So I want you to teach him a good lesson. Oh shit! What the? But why do you need me to knock your own son? What the hell is wrong with you, Mikey? Yeah, why Jimmy off all people? This doesn't make any sense, Uncle Mike. I never expected a father who wants his kid to be hurt. Jesus, something is really wrong with you. No, nothing is wrong with me. That bastard really deserves this. You won't understand like this. Just let me take you one week ago. Yeah, that's right. This all started one week ago. A lady was oh being God. threatened by one of Bella's. Oh, no. And guess who arrived on the scene? I think the cops. I'm so no, 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 it was Jimmy off all people. And you should be proud of him instead of making him look bad. First year the full story, kid. What? Oh, what the? Oh my god! That lady is in real trouble. 
I gotta do something to save her. But damn, what can I do? I can't go one-on-one -on -one with the ballast. They are real tough, man. I'm scared to do that. When will it end? When will it end? Oh, damn it. I guess I have no choice. Let but to save her myself. All right, this crowbar looks good. He might be terrified by this. All right, Jimmy, let's go and save that girl. Don't be scared, Jimmy. Come on, you got this. Yeah, this looks real good. I'm gonna knock him good with crowbar. Come on, Jimmy, you got this, you got this. Hey, you bastard. Just let her go, you damn bala. How dare you throw a lady right in front of the great Jimmy who- Damn, that was a good line. He must have been really terrified. Get off, you psycho. Fuck off, you psychotic idiot. <laughs> this is baller time. Man, I'm telling you, you need to get the fuck out of here. If someone gets hurt, it's your fault. I warn you, I'm weaker than I look. Someone could get hurt. Baller's going to bang. I'm going to fuck you up. Oh, That's my be Chucky. Get him up. Fuck him up. All right, you freak. Bring it on, sucker. Let's see what you got. Oh, yes. Yes, yes. I did it. I defeated a Bala. Oh, on my own? Man, this is just amazing. Hey, sweetheart, you okay? You're not hurt, right? No, no, no. I'm fine, and it's all thanks to you, darling. You really saved my ass here. From today onwards, you are my real hero. Man, I just love it. Thank you for saving me. Hey, dog, gun done it. What are they shouting? Big J, Big J, the fat kid's only gone and done it. The crowd goes wild. And that's the whole story. I know it's a good thing that he saved her, but just defeating one ballast. He is acting real tough from that day onwards. He is thinking everyone has a weakling in front of him. He is going and challenging some random dudes to a fight. And now he is saying me that he is ready to walk on my footsteps. He is thinking to be a big gangster. And the only one who can stop him is you, Franklin. You see, I don't want to hurt him. So will Hello you there, this Franklin one? and little kiddo Benjamin. Oh, J Dog, that's too fucking sweet. Now that I Fuck think about it, it, yes, you're you right, Uncle that? Mike, because he never calls me a kiddo like I'm that. Dangerous. Something has really changed. And in I'm him. feeling amazing today. I feel the power of Hundred of Warriors in me. This new power is really surging in me. And I really love this. All right, guys, I'm sure he will provoke one of you guys. Just an eye for everything, okay? Hey, Franklin, by the way. What's that briefcase in your hand? Don't tell me you're back here to lend some money from my dad. Can't you do anything by yourself? Man, you are pathetic. Then I'm about you and me one-on-one, -on -one, huh? Let's see who wins. Come on, Franklin. Show me what you got. Or you're just a scaredy pussy just like my dad. Oh, no, man, no. I can't fight you, Jimmy. I don't want to hurt you. Come on, admit it. You are scared to fight me, ain't that right? Hey, kiddo, do you know what? You should stop following your loser of a father. You should follow someone like me, a real champion. Just let me show how a real champion looks like. Oh shit! Come on, Franklin, what fight me. Show hey, what? me what you got. What the Come on, fuck? let's do this, you oh, and me. Shit. Fight me, fight me, loser. Oh, shit! Shit, no! Oh no, man, no! Fuck, no! No! Hey, would you just shut up, please? Just stop annoying them, you bastard Jimmy. Leave them alone. You're going way too far. Just because you defeated one guy doesn't mean you can defeat anyone. Oh, stop it, loser. I don't want to be lectured by a loser like you. That's the last thing I don't want. So stop right there and see your kids surpassing you. You know what, Jimmy, bro? I will fight you. You want a good fight, right? Then I accept your challenge. Come on, let's do this, you and me. Kid, you're no match for me. I thought to take you in as my right hand man. But you are disappointed me. You want to fight? Let's do this. All right then, bring Someone it on! Hurt. Come on, is that all you Probably got? Me. Talk about being badass! Man, you're still a kid, oh Jimmy bro! You are no chatch for me, I guess. I have learned everything from my father, but I don't show off like you! you. You're still weak and pathetic! Uh -oh. There you go! Bam! Whoa! Wow! <laughs> Maybe you just got lucky defeating that Bella! You are still not as tough as you think, so you should stop focusing on that. Maybe this would have taught you a good lesson. Next time, put some respect on my dad's name when you talk to him, or else there will be more of this punches coming after you. What the hell? I can't believe this. I lost two kiddo, man. This really sucks big time. Maybe I was thinking wrong. I'm not strong. I'm still the same weak, Jimmy. Whoa, Benjamin, you are really strong. Maybe getting defeated by you would have changed him now. 
Thanks a lot for that, Benjamin and Franklin. I really owe you guys for this. No, Uncle Mike. He really deserved that more than anything. And we are the one who owes you for this cash. So thank you and see you later. Yeah, good, Barbo. See you later. Hey, don't worry about the money. Think that has a favor from me. After all, you're my friends and me. So that's the least I can do for my best friends. And yeah, see you later, Benjamin and Franklin. Yeah, see you later, Uncle Mike. Have a nice day. Oh, yeah, Father, we got the cash. There's just one more thing to do, and that is to upgrade our car. So, Father, have you thought any new designs for our car? Oh, yes, Benjamin. I have thought about a design. I'm thinking to turn this car into a supercar. Now that's what I'm talking about. Supercar than it is. Oh, man, I can't wait for the upgradation. All right, guys, we have arrived here at Benny's Motor Works. Let's see if he can turn this car into a supercar, and then we go. Hey, Franklin, long time no see, pal. So what can I do for you? Hello there, Benny. Hey, Benny, you see, I want to turn this car into a supercar. Change everything, do whatever you need. Just turn my car into a beautiful supercar. Okay, Franklin, I will see what I can do. But don't get your hopes up. This looks a real difficult task to me. But I will try my best. But tell me, have you got the cash ready? Yes, Uncle Benny, the cash is all ready. You just keep your head in the game. Just focus on turning this car into a supercar. Oh, okay, that's nice. All right, then come back tomorrow, Franklin. I will try my best to upgrade this thing. All right, son, let's keep going. Benny, see you tomorrow. Make sure you do this right. All right, Benjamin, let's take a taxi and head back home. Oh, yeah, father. Man, I can't wait for tomorrow. This is going to be so much fun. The next day. Oh, yes, the day is finally here. Man, I'm really pumped for this. What about you, father? Yeah, even I'm excited for this. I'm sure he would have done that. All right, here we are. Let's go, Benjamin. Let's freaking go. All right, sir, we have reached your designated destination. Thanks a lot, my man. All right, let's get in, Benjamin. Oh, my good lord. Holy, this is, this is Juju, just fantastic. He really has done it. He has really turned our car into a supercar. You see that? <laughs> Oh, yes, 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 yes! Man, I just love this! This is really so cool. Just what I expected, man. I love this new designs. This is just awesome, fabulous, marvelous. This is outstanding. I don't have enough words to describe this. This right here is a real beauty. Thanks a lot for this car, my homie. Yeah, anytime, Franklin Dog. Go and enjoy your ride. Yep, all right, then see you later, homie. Ooh, just what we needed. Oh, uh, yes! I'm sure Mom will freak out, too, because this is really top-notch. Woohoo, I really love this supercar. Just look how fast this is. Oh, yeah, baby, faster, faster. Hell, yeah, that's what I'm talking about. So this is it for today, guys. Hope you loved the video. If you did, then please like, share, and subscribe. And we will see you guys in our next video. Until then, peace, and see you all later. This is the life. Hell yeah. Oh yeah. Oh yes, 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 yes. Dad, this is going to be so much fun. Man, I can't wait for the next upgrading. Man, this is going to be awesome for sure. Hello guys. Welcome back to my channel, Osprey Gaming. As you can see, we have turned this house into this. And then again in looking like this. And we have even turned our car from looking like this into this. A super car, but never have we ever upgraded our bike. So today we are going to just do that. We will upgrade Franklin's bike, but for doing that we need at least $100,000. And unfortunately Franklin doesn't have that many. As you can see he just has $10,000. We still need 90 k and Franklin is gonna make sure that he gets 90 k before the end of this day. So without ado, let's hear it from Franklin and Benjamin. Dad, so what are we gonna do, eh? We still need 90 k It's not like we can just lend it from someone. That's pretty huge amount of cash. So have you got anything in mind, Dad? Yeah, you're right, Benjamin. But I got a guy in my mind. I'm sure he would be happy to help us out. And who's that Dad? He goes by the name of Dave Norton. Ooh, I have sent close. you about him. Do you remember? Oh, yeah, yeah, I remember him. He is the guy who promised on this mic to take him in Los Santos' movie, right? But later he denied it. Oh, you are right on point, Benjamin, my son. Hello there, Franklin. Long time no see. So what made you yeah, come here today? Yeah, long time no see, homie. Hey, you see, man, I want to upgrade my bike, but the case is that I'm running low on cash. So can you lend us some money? We will do anything. 
give us any job, or give us any small part role in one of your movies, which can make us $100,000, anything will do it. Hey, 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 Uncle Dave! Look, my acting is top notch! See this one, a drunken kid? You see that? You are the... I'm a drunken kid. What, 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 dream, what is he dream, doing? Drunken. This is I'm so ridiculous. Or how, how about this? I, I hear. Give me some fighting Look, scene. Look, we are professional at everything. Us being in the movie would sure be blockbuster here. Sorry, Franklin, but I don't have any jobs for you guys now. You see, there was not that energy in your voice and acting. Thus making it look bad. Everyone should feel you when they are watching you. What I felt was a ridiculous bunch of crap. Look over there, that is what I call professional. That over there is top notch. And I'm sorry to disappoint you guys. Really? That is what he calls professional. Man, this guy sorry, sucks. Sorry, Franklin, I don't have anything to offer you now. You guys are best at what you do. But when it comes to acting, I would always choose them over you. So sorry, see you later now. Just stay back and let me go, or else I will shoot the life out of her. You don't want that to happen now, do you, George? <laughs> really? You're coming into my town, scaring my hometown peoples. I ain't gonna let that happen. Wherever there's darkness, there's always a light. And thus I'm that light. Now I shall consume you with my light. I'm the the the. Oh crap, I forgot my lines. Sorry about that, you guys. Now, what was that line? What was it? <laughs> Damn it! Let's do it again! Just let me remember that once again. Come on, George, it's the justice line. I'm going to be the justice. Man, I could have done that better myself. Not choosing us was the biggest mistake he has ever did. Well, I pity him. That's the reason why Los Santos movie sucks. Come on, Dad, let's go hit the guy yeah, for Benjamin, us. Yeah, Benjamin, you are right, my son. That really ain't our style. Let's go and ask someone else. Who's more dependable than Dave? So who are you referring to, Dad? Have you got someone else than him in your mind? Yeah, of course. And in fact, you know him very well. The person I'm talking about is Lamar, my homie. Oh, yeah, now that's more I like him. Ooh, I'm sure gross. that he would lend us some money for sure. He won't deny us just like how that loser did back there. Sorry, my homie Franklin and Benjamin. But at this moment, I don't have any job or that amount of cash. So sorry to disappoint the both of you. Hope you understand. Yeah, all right, dog. we understand. Sorry for bothering you anyway. But Lamar, tell me what's with those beautiful ladies over here. Are you planning on something, eh, Lamar? You know what it is, homie. The big dog is gonna bang them tonight. You know, you feel me, eh, Franklin? Ha ha ha. Kiss should have expected that from the classic Lamar. All right, homie, I will leave you with that. Enjoy and have fun. <laughs> yeah, all right, Franklin. And oh yeah, good luck collecting that money. I hope you get it done quick. Yes, yeah, sure thing, my homie. All right, then see you later now. Yeah, bye, Franklin and Benjamin. See you later, homies. Yeah, sure thing, Lamar, bro. See you later. So what do we do now, Dad? These were the best option that we had got. Now, how do we collect all that money? Don't you have someone else who could offer us a job? That would make us 100K or 90 at least. Yeah, I got one more, don't worry. I'm sure he must have a job for us. And that's your Uncle Lest. I sure have a lot of history with that old man. I'm sure he would be happy to help us out. Oh, yes, 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 yes! All right then, Dad, let's head to Uncle Lester! I can't wait to see that old man. All right, Franklin, here that's you go. Cool, the done. money that you need. Oh, hell yeah! I knew that you wouldn't disappoint us, old man. Thank you for all the cash. Man, you are really the best. All right, Franklin, about the job. Now let me get to the point. You see, after Trevor sold this club to me, I have been kind of busy lately. I don't have time for my wife. I don't have time for anything, you know. And I'm busting my ass of here to make this club the number one of Los Santos. And in the meanwhile, a dude is hooking with my wife and banging her left and right. Oh crap, I can't believe that I'm doing this. But oh well. Oh man, I'm so sorry to hear that, Lester. That must have been pretty hard for you. Here, Franklin, take a look at this. One day I was scrolling through Instagram and that is when I found this. You see, it's my wife Carrie with this dude instead of me being there. There's not a single photo of mine. It's just that guy and her. Man, this is making me so sick. This keeps on getting worse and worse. Just look at their poses. That's horrible. Look now at their house. With this picture, I figured out where he lives. So I want you to teach a good lesson for me. Just tell that bastard to stay away from my wife. Please, Franklin, teach that SOB a good lesson. That he never ever could wander around my wife again. Oh yeah, of course I will. Don't you worry about him. He is ours to handle now. I know what you had to go through. But that will end today. And I promise to make that happen. Alright, Benjamin, hurry up, get in.
Let's go and kick some ass. Thanks a lot, Franklin, homie. And by the way, he lives near the baller's hood, behind the basketball court. Yeah, I got you, dawg. Just make sure that carry doesn't find out about this. Of course, Franklin. You just focus on that bastard. And once again, thanks a lot for this. Oh, yes, 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 yes! We are about to kick some ass. Man, this is going to be fun. No, Benjamin, you're not getting involved in any of this. Just stay behind and let your dad handle this, because if your mom finds out about this, then she's surely going to turn into a monster. And we don't want that to happen now. Don't we, Benjamin? Okay, Dad, as you say... Hey, 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 look, Dad, I guess that's the guy we are looking for. Yeah, it's him all right. Okay, Benjamin, stay here until I deal with those fools. Take care of the briefcase. And here I go. Uh-huh, Dad. Go and get them. I will be cheering you from here. What the... What the hell is going on? Who are you, anyway? Dad sure got that first guy good. But, man, I feel bad for him. But still, that was awesome. Hey, are you the guy who hangs out with Carrie? Oh, what am I even saying? Oh, of course it's him, because I saw the yeah, pictures. Yeah, so what about that guy? It's not like you can do anything about it. Just beating one guy doesn't scare me. Just knock some sense into him, Dad. Yeah, you are doing it good. Woohoo! Hey, 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 watch your hand, dog. You, you don't want to make me angry. Huh? Just let oh, settle this like a up? real gentleman. Let, me go, let me go, let me go, you bastard. There's you nothing you have left to talk like gentlemen's. You have crossed the damn line. And now I ain't gonna hold anything back. You're gonna pay man, for what you did. Man, fuck you and everyone. I had the fun that I wanted with Carrie. But still, man, I needed more from her. But it looks like I have to go through you and his dumb husband. Then let's get it started. I will knock you out for her. And when I'm done having fun with her, then I will move on with her. Ha 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 ha. Man, you suck. You're not gonna get your dirty hands on her ever again. Let this be your lesson, you damn freak. Don't you dare lay your eyes on her ever again. Not just a don't you dare use any women for your only needs. Treasure them with respect. And if I catch you do this again, then you're gonna be a history. Make sure you always remember that. Okay, okay, I'm sorry. I promise I will never do that again. Whoa, oh, Dad! That was amazing you gave him a good-ass teaching. I'm sure he will remember that for a long time. Yeah, of course that bastard will. All right, Benjamin, my son, buckle up, because now we have on our money, and now we are heading straight towards the Benny's Motor Works. Man, this is going to be cool for sure. Woohoo! Just what I have been waiting for! Man, our bike is going to be upgraded now! Yes, 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 hey, yes, yes, yes! Lost, this huh? is going to be amazing for sure! All right, guys, we have arrived here at the Benny's Motor Works. Let's get in and tell Benny about how we want to upgrade this bike. Uh oh yeah, Dad! I can't wait to see this what bike's final look! Hello there, Benny, my man. Hey, look, we want to upgrade this bike. Just turn this bike into a super bike, just like the last time, like how you did to my car. Just make this the finest looking bike of whole Los Santos. Yeah, that's right. The finest and the most coolest bike of Los Santos. Okay, I will do what I can. Just don't get your hopes that high, because this really looks tough. But believe me when I say this, that I'm going to try my best to get this job done, and this Willemolts cost you 80 to 100k. Oh yeah, we knew that. Here's the money that is required for the bike upgrading. Oh nice now, that's what I'm talking about. Alright Franklin, you better get going now. Come back later tomorrow, I will try my best to best to turn this bike into super bike. Just a faith in me. Yeah, alright homie, see you later then tomorrow. Hey Benjamin, son, let's get going. Let's take a taxi and head back home. Oh, hell yeah, Dad! Man, oh man, I can't wait for tomorrow! This is going to be epic. Goodbye, Uncle Benny. Make sure they get the job done. Of course he will get it done, Benjamin. Well, now I'll just let's head home. I need to take some rest. Franklin and Benjamin were eagerly the waiting, next day. and just like that it was the next day. So let's see if Benny has upgraded the bike or not. Oh man, oh man, we are here at last! Let's just hope that Benny doesn't disappoint us. Of course he will not! Alright, gentlemen, we are here at your designated destination. Yeah, thanks a lot, homie. Alright, Benjamin, let's get in. The moment of truth is here. Let's keep our fingers crossed! Ha <laughs> ha! You see that? Holy, 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 that's amazing! Woohoo! Oh, yes, 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 yes! This is really marvelous! Man, I love the new look! This is so well designed! Uncle Benny is the best, not the best! He is the Thanks greatest! Thanks a lot for the bike, homie! You really made our day with this! You're just awesome, amazing, fabulous! What can I say? You're everything! Jesus, Jesus! Calm down, Franklin, I appreciate it! But that's too much, man! Thanks for all the good words! Go and enjoy your ride now! See you someday later again. Yeah, alright, homie.
guess we will do that. And once again, thanks a bunch. Hey, Benjamin, my son, get in. Let's get this baby started. Oh, yeah, let's start rolling, Dad. And now with this, we are gonna rock it, baby. I'm sure Mom is gonna love this, too, because this is just filled that way. Oh, yeah, father, faster, faster. <laughs> now that is what I'm talking about. Oh, hell yeah, Benjamin is loving this. So this is it for today, guys. Hope you had fun. Thanks for watching me. Please make sure to like, share, and subscribe. And we will see you all later in our next video. Oh, yeah. Father, make it more fast, fast. Yes, now, that's more. I like it. But my guys, bye. Woohoo! Hello, guys. Welcome back to my channel, Osprey Gaming. And one afternoon, Franklin and his kid were returning back from a long road trip. That is when they stumbled upon this big new mansion near the sandy shores. Hey, Dad, look at that big mansion. Man, that's so uh -oh. cool. Hey, hey, uh -oh. hey, Dad, look. Uh, oh, on sale God. board. I think the property manager is selling this house. Oh, oh. yes, Benjamin. Oh, Let's go and man. have a talk with the property manager. Because, man, I love this. And now we are going to purchase this house. Oh, yeah, for sure, Dad. And later they had a chat with the mansion owner himself. And this is what he had to say. Yes, gentlemen, this mansion is on sale. But this is worth more than you expect of. This mansion is worth a $5 million. Oh, come on, homie. Please do us a favor and please make this three million pretty, please. We really love this mansion and we don't want someone else to get their hands on them. All right, then. I guess I have no choice because I really need all the cash that I can get for now. All right, gentlemen, you got yourself a deal. I will sell this mansion for three million dollars. But first, tell your viewers to like, share and subscribe. Hey, guys, whoever is watching this video, then please make sure to like, share and subscribe to the channel and to the video so we can buy this house in three million dollars. Pretty please, guys, do. All right, that was good enough. Consider it has done. But you have only left one day. If you fail to give me three million dollars by tomorrow evening, then I would have no choice left to sell this to someone else. Oh, OK, sure, I got that. Don't worry, I will pay you on time. Hey, Benjamin, let's go, son. And now back to the present day. As you can see, Franklin has done it all. He turned his house into a super house. And later, he upgraded his car from looking this into looking like this. He upgraded everything. He turned his bike from this to this super looking bike. But Franklin has never purchased a big bungalow like that ever in his life. But today, we will just do that. But to buy that mansion, we need a total amount of $3 million. And as you can see from all of Franklin's savings, he just has to point $5 million in his account. And just eight more hours are left, and Franklin is still missing $500,000. So let's see how will he get that huge amount of cash in next eight hours. After all the savings, we just have to point $5 million left. We still need 500 k for that beautiful big mansion. And damn, we just have eight hours left. So what do we do, Dad? What do we do? Just give me a minute to thank Benjamin. Since we don't do crimes these days, getting that amount of cash is pretty tough. But still, there's one guy who does this crimes till now, and I'm sure that he could help us out. All right, Benjamin, so get in the car. We are going to Lamar's place. Oh, yes, 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 yes. I'm sure that he would help us out. Man, I love Lamar, bro. I can't wait to meet that fool. All right, everyone, Lamar it is. Let's go, Dad, let's go. Yeah, of course, Benjamin, son. Let's just hope that Lamar doesn't disappoint us. Of course he won't. I know that guy. He sure will help us out. Or by any chance, if he doesn't have the money, then I'm sure he must have a job that suits our needs. So just chill down, relax, and get us to Lamar. Yeah, I guess you are right after all. Just let's put our faith in Lamar, homie. All right, Lamar, we are coming to get you. Please don't disappoint us. And just like us. that, Franklin and Benjamin decided to lend some money from Lamar. So let's hey, see what's going to happen. Hey, hello there, homies. So what made you come here today, Franklin and Benjamin? Because, man, you usually don't show up to this place, unless you want something for yourself. And I'm sure that you're here for that same reason again, eh? Ain't that right, Franklin? Sorry it had to be this way, Lamar. And yeah, you are right. You see, Lamar, we are about to buy a big mansion. But damn, we are running low on $500,000. So it would be nice if you lend us that money. Or in any case, if you don't have that amount of cash. And I sure know you must have something for us that can easily get us to 500000 Yeah, we will do anything, unless it's not a crime. I'm sorry, Franklin and Benjamin, but I don't have that amount of cash right now. But you see, we are planning to rob the Fleeka Bank. The heist would start in three hours from now. So if you want, you can join us. And by the way, no good job pays you 500 k for one day, unless it's a crime. So what do you say, Franklin? Are you in or what? Sorry, homie, but I have to pass on that. I don't want to walk on that footsteps again. And heck, if my wife founds about this, then she will be damn mad on us. And man, I don't want to go through that. So is there anything else rather than that? Sorry, Franklin, but that is what I had to offer you. There's nothing else, homie. And as I said before, there's no good job in the world that pays you that much amount of cash. Unless it's a crime. 
Oh, okay, Lamar. Sorry for bothering you. All right, Benjamin, son, let's get going. Yeah, sorry for bothering you, Lamar, bro. And yeah, see you later. Take care of yourself. Oh, yeah, and you guys do the same. And good luck finding all that cash. See you later, homies. So Bye what now. now, Dad? He was our best option. And since we don't do crime any more, then this is going to be tough. Don't you have some else in your mind that can lend us that money? Anything at all. Just remember, Dad, I know you must have someone in your contact that can offer us that money. Yeah, I got Ooh, one more guy, and that is Simeon. Last time we went to him, but then he denied us. Let's see if he can offer us this time or not. Sorry, Franklin, but I don't have anything that I can offer you right now. I don't have money, nor do I have some work that can offer you that much. As you can see, Franklin, business these days aren't going well. I know I said you the same thing last time, but believe me when I'm saying this, I'm saying the truth. It's been one week and I haven't sold a single car yet. So I hope you understand, Whatever, buddy. Real cool. Yeah. Uh-huh. All right, Benjamin, son, get in the car. We are leaving. All right, Simeon, homie, it was nice seeing you. See you later by now. Yeah, see you later, Franklin, by now. Man, this guy is a jerk. He always give us the same excuse. He doesn't even know to tell a good lie. Man, I hate this guy so much. We shouldn't have come here. What were we thinking asking to him? Oh, cool down, Benjamin. That's how he is, don't mind him. Let's just leave that behind and move forward. And by moving forward, let's go to Trevor's place now. I'm sure he would be happy to help us oh, out. Oh, yeah, that old man sure knows a way to make everyone happy. All right, Dad, Uncle Trevor it is. Oh, yes, my friends, you have come to the right place and at the right time. I sure Sure can't help you out on this. You need money, I got money. You see that? Oh, yes, 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 yes. I knew ah. it. Man, you're the best of best, Uncle Shit. Trevor. You really oh. are awesome. <laughs> Mm. Oh, yeah, but just on one condition. And that condition is, I'm so man, that is so crazy. All right, here it is, Franklin. I want your hot wife to dance in front of me so I can oh. get all pumped up. So what do you say, Franklin? Can I consider this as a deal or what? <laughs> what the? Hey, what? Oh, shit. What the fuck? What the hell is wrong with you, old man? How dare you talk about my mom like that? And Aunt Velvet, how could you even laugh? I guess marrying to Trevor has turned you into a psycho as well. You're gonna pay for this and I will make you pay right here and now. <laughs> just look at that kid Trevor. He is getting all fired up. Hey kid, that was just a joke. You got them good honey. Sorry Franklin, but I don't have the money. And I was just joking about your wife's stuff. I don't need anyone else in my life now. Not Amanda or nor your wife mate. Cause I myself have got an hot baby. Who serves all my needs? You bastard, how dare you pull a joke like that on us? If you were my friend, then I would've whipped your ass on the floor right here. Fuck it, punk! I love you. I love you. I love you. I love you. Oh, just calm it down, Franklin. That was just a joke. If you want to get serious, then that's your problem. And by the way, can you please go now? I want to have some alone time with my babes over here. So yeah. please do me a favor and get oh, going already. Yeah, we are going, you psychos. Now. Man, who in the hell does he think he is? Man, if Velvet wasn't around him, then I would have smacked Trevor's ass all over this place. That bastard really got lucky just because we are in a rush. Just because we were here to lend some money doesn't mean that he can say anything. Dad, you are right. He really got lucky. But damn, Dad, where do we go now? We just have six more hours left. Have you got someone else? How about we ask on this mic about it? Yeah, let's go to Michael's place. He helped us the last time, and we even paid that money with interest. So let's just hope that Michael helps us again. All right, Mikey, you are our last option. Please just don't disappoint us, buddy. All right, Franklin, here you go. I got the money for you. But you know what you have to do to earn it right? I know you have left all the crimes, but to do this, you have to become one. So it's all up to you take it or leave it. So what do you say, Franklin, buddy? Are you in for this or what? Guess I'm always right all along. There's no good job that pays you that good amount of money in just one day. Hey, son, I guess we have no choice left but to do this. But promise me that you won't tell your mom anything about this. Don't worry, father. I won't say her anything. Think this has a secret between father and son. Just go do your job and earn that money. Hey, guys, don't worry. The person that we are about to steal is not a good guy. He is the worst off whole Los Santos. He has done way to crimes than you and me included. Just think as you're robbing a robber, cause trust me when I say this, they really deserve every single bit of this. Oh, just what I needed to hear. All right, Mikey, consider this as a deal. Let's do this thing. A few moments later. All right, now this looks good. With this, no one can identify us. It's a good thing Amanda and Tracy weren't home. 
But lucky for Benjamin, I guess. Because Jimmy is in his room playing games. All right, guys, be careful out there. And best of luck! All right, big bro Jimmy, I'm coming to get ya! So what is it that I have to do, Michael? Are you gonna explain me or what? Or you're just gonna keep me in the dark? Hey, we need to steal some million-dollar art paintings from Martin the Gangster's house. Lester has given me all the blueprints of that house. And I figured out a way to sneak in the house without getting noticed by the security guards. But you have to knock out the front guards to sneak in. And I guess you can handle that easily. Oh, yeah, of course I can. All right, I'm in the house. Guess this is the art paintings Michael wanted. Can't believe that this is worth million dollars. But still, I never thought this would be so easy to steal. But I wonder, why did Michael say me that if something bad happens? That he would step in to help me. Because, man, this really looks easy. Just had to knock the front guards to get in. Well, whatever the case, I better hurry up and collect all the paintings. All right, kid, this is the place. And that's the house where all those paintings are. Now tell me, you ready to pull this off or what? And don't worry, if something happens, I will step in to help you out. Oh, man, you don't have to worry about me. I got this. Just stay here and relax. I will get you all those paintings that you need. Look at that. There you go. Come on, Elf. Ah, come on, Franklin. Here we go. Come on. Come on, Franklin. Don't worry, you guys. You will be spun later. Okay, let's go. All right, this is the last painting. And now with this is all done, I better get the hell out of here before anyone shows up. Oh, shit. Shit, no. Alert, alert, everyone. We got an intruder. Intruder alert, intruder alert. No, no, no. Hey, let's do this, motherfucker. Hey, you enjoying yourself now, huh? Hey, let's do this. Damn, there are way too many of this punks. I guess this is what might come meant that if something goes wrong, you would step in. But damn, where in the hell is he? I really could use his help right now. Franklin, hurry the hell up! Get in the car, bud! Let's get going from here! By the way, Franklin, you did an excellent job! Man, I'm proud of you! Yeah, alright, dawg! Let's get going before any more of this punk shows up! Hey, 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 Michael! Look, it's them again, they are following us! What do we do now? Don't worry, Franklin, oh. I already took care of this! There it is! Bang, bang, bang! Ha-ha! Woo! Ha-ha! Oh, don't sweat it, Franklin! You know how it is, when you were inside the house stealing all those paintings, and I wasn't just sitting on my ass and doing nothing. I knew that this would happen, so I had some booby traps set. Uh oh, oh, hey. that was just awesome, Michael. Whoa, ho, ho, whoa! La la, hell yeah, Dad, you did it! Go -dog. Man, you're just Go -dog. awesome. Go -dog. Now we got uh -huh. all the cash to buy that mansion. Now we are gonna have some real all fun. All right, Benjamin, my son. Let's get going now. We just have two hours left, so let's hurry it up, okay? And Michael, thanks a lot for all this cash. Man, you are really the best. Yeah, thanks a lot, Uncle Mike. Yeah, sure, guys. All right, Jimmy, let's go and play some games. Your mom and sis are gonna be late, so let's go and enjoy until then. That's what I'm talking about. Uh-huh. So, Dad, how was the task that Uncle Mike gave you? Was it really dangerous? Yeah, that was really dangerous. But don't worry, your father took care of it all. Now let's get to the house and pick up your mom. And then let's head straight to our big new mansion. Oh yeah, now that is what I like to hear, big mansion! And at last Franklin somehow managed to collect all those money. And later they even took care of the paperwork and the agreements. And now this mansion officially belongs to Franklin and his family. Oh, yeah. So let's hear it from them. Oh yes, 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 yes! We finally did it! Man, this is so amazing! Yeah. Woohoo, you're the best! Dad, you're the best! Oh guys, just look at this house! Man, this is so huge! Woohoo, I really love this! I bet we can even play soccer in here! 
Just what we needed. All right, let's go and check the upper floors. Now, what's this say? All right, let's get in. Ooh, ho, ho. Oh, hell yeah. This is freaking huge. I love this new master bedroom. And looks, guys, we even have a king-size bed. And man, look up there. It's Mr. Beast and all his crew. I guess the owner was a Mr. Beast fan just like me. All right, then it's official. This room belongs to the great Benjamin now. You see that? Just what I needed in my house. This house offer us everything. We got a pool cue here. We got table tennis. We got a big lounge. And man, what a great scenery. Look, guys, isn't this just awesome? I don't have enough words to describe this house. This is truly amazing. Marvelous, fabulous, gorgeous, everything that a man could ask for. I bet even Benjamin and May would have loved this for sure. Ooh, yeah, baby, ooh, yeah. This is cool for sure. Franklin really stumbled upon a good house. This is freaking awesome garage. Now Franklin can even store 10 plus vehicles in this. And oh, girl, I can't get enough off this view. Because this is pretty gorgeous. Oh, yeah, baby. Nice. Really so how's the mansion, nice. baby? Did you, you go, like girl. it? Ooh, yeah, oh, of great. course I loved nice. it. You are really the best Rip. when it comes to stuff yeah, like baby. this. All right, then, let's have some fun. I'm oh, about to get yeah. wild on you, and heck now we can shout all we want. Benjamin ain't gonna listen to us, and he sure won't disturb us now. So let's get the party started, oh, Bobby. Yeah. Um, yeah. Let's see what you got, Franklin. Yeah, come on, get me wild, honey. Guess Mom and Dad are busy in something, so I got into the outro now. So this is for today, guys. Thanks for watching us. Please like, share, and subscribe, and we will see you all in our next video. Until then, bye, peace, and have fun. Hello guys! Welcome back to my channel, Osprey Gaming. First off, all Happy New Year to everyone. I wish everyone's resolution come true this year. And now let's get started. As you know, Franklin purchased this new mansion in last video for $3 million. And now Franklin and Benjamin have decided to kick off the new year with a bang. So they have decided in Disneyland trip. So without ado, let's hear it from them. All right, Benjamin, my son, let's get going. Let's ask your mom if she want to join us or not in this adventure. Oh, yes, Dad. Of course she's going to join us. Who would ever think of missing a Disneyland trip? Oh, hell yeah, I guess you are right about that, son. Darn it, this is going to be such a pain in the arse. I got to do this all by myself. Oh, well, there's nothing we can do now, so let's get started. Hey, sweetheart, I and Benjamin are planning to go on a Disneyland trip. So how about you join us, too? Pretty please join us. I know you have got things to do, but how about we wrap that up later? Yeah, Mom, let's wrap this things all later, because I really need all of our family together in this Disneyland trip so we can enjoy it all together. Yeah, I really wanted to enjoy with you guys. But you know that we just shifted our house, and now I got to arrange all this at its places, and as you know me, I don't like living unfinished business so I'm sorry but I will try my best to wrap this quickly as possible but I need the power of the viewers so Franklin please tell the viewers to like share and subscribe oh okay hey guys whoever is watching this video then please like share and subscribe to the video and to the channel so may could join us in this Disneyland trip pretty please guys do it and share or tag this to that one friend who loves adventures all right that was quite awesome I got the power that I needed. Don't worry, Franklin. I will try my best to wrap this up quickly. In the meanwhile, why don't get some more folks to join us in this trip? Because you know the more they are, the more fun. Oh, of course, of course, baby. Don't worry. We will get some friend to join us in this trip. You just focus on doing the best at what you do. And hey, guys, thank you for giving all the power that made my wife need. And yeah, happy new year to everyone. Let's make all of our dream come true in 2024. So who are we going to recruit dad for Disneyland trip dad? Hey, Have you got no, someone no, in your no. mind? You know, Trevor Holm is nearby. So let's go and invite him first. Let's see if he joins or not. Why, hello. Franklin and Benjamin. I thought you would never show up to this place after what yeah, happened the last time. let just say we thought time. about that. It's a new year and a new beginning, so let's forget about what happened that day. And now let's kick off the year with a bang. Hey, Trevor, we are about to go on a Disneyland trip, and we would love to have you in this trip as well. Yeah, Uncle Trev, join us. I'm sure you being there would make this more exciting. And by the way, where's Aunt Velvet? We would love to have her too. <laughs> mm. Now that's what I'm talking about. Oh, hell yeah, and A-Velvet is taking a nice deep nap. So it would be wise if we don't disturb her. You want to go to Disneyland, right? Then hell yeah, let's do this oh, thing. Oh, yes, 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 yes. Got her first recruit. Man, I wish even mom could join us in time. Yeah, let's hope she makes it in time. For now, let's do what's best for us, and that is to recruit everyone. What? Oh, fuck. Are you joking me, Franklin? 
No women is equal to no fun. Now tell me, is May coming to the trip or not? I don't know, Trevor. I can't really say if she can make it or not. Just let's hope for the best that she joins us after she's uh, done with the work. You're kind of... Mm, 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 weird. Uh, I, 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 I don't feel so good. Oh. So sorry to disappoint you guys. But I think I can't oh. make it. I was in a nice mood a while ago, but now I don't feel so good. So please, Franklin and Benjamin, go on without me. I'm sorry, guys. Hope you understand. Understand? What? That you don't make any sense! Man, Trevor is a real weird ass. The last time when we were here, he said he doesn't need any women in his life now, rather than Velvet, and now he isn't joining us in this trip. Just because he heard that if Mom could make it in time or not, man, he really gets me sometimes. Hey, Benjamin, so cool down. Take a deep breath and relax. That's how Trevor is. He doesn't make any sense. So just leave him with that. Let's head to our other recruit, our homie Lamar. Franklin, I would have loved to spend some time with you and your family. But you see, man, I was awake all day long yesterday, and I haven't gotten any sleep. I'm feeling weak right now. Ha 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 And you know this ex could leave what I wanted. Now I'm gonna set a Guinness World Record of sleeping. I'm gonna break Peter Power's record of eight days. As you can see, the timer is set. So I'm sorry I can't join you guys. And yeah, please wish me luck, Franklin. Man, what you say? Sleeping world record. He has really gone nuts. They are getting weirder and weirder day by day. This really sucks. Thank you for understanding me, you guys. And now please get going and let me make a new world record. Okay, Lamar, homie. I guess I will leave you with that. Enjoy, and yeah, good luck breaking that record. All right, Benjamin, let's go. Lamar will be joining us in this trip. Let's go for someone else who can join us. Oh, Jesus, these guys are really boring. They don't know what fun is. Man, I never expected this from Lamar, bro. Oh, don't worry, Benjamin. Everyone has their own way of enjoyment, and you can't blame Lamar or Trevor for that. So just relax, and let's go and search for our next recruit. Dad, I know how your friends are, and I don't trust them anymore. So how about we go to some of my friends? I'm sure they would be really happy to join us. All right, as you say, son. So which friend would you like us to join in our Disneyland trip? How about Daniel, Dad? He is my best friend and I know that he won't deny us. All right then, Daniel it is. Oh, yes! Now this is what I'm talking about. All right, Daniel, my friend, we are coming to get ya! Hello there, Benjamin and Uncle Franklin. So what's going on? Is there anything that I can help you with? Yeah, hello, Daniel. Hey, you see we are going on Disneyland trip. So we would like you to join us in our wonderful trip. And yeah, don't worry about anything. Because everything is on my dad. So now what are you waiting for, huh? Let's get it rolling, Daniel. Wow, that's so cool. Man, I wish I could have joined you guys. You see, Benjamin, my family has some other plans for the 1st of January. So I'm sorry I can't join you all. But maybe we can go there the next time. You know there's always next time, right? By Benjamin and Uncle Franklin. See you guys later. Yes, yeah, see you later, Daniel. And have fun. Enjoy the trip. Yeah, bye-bye, you sucker. Well, are you kidding me? Off all the places you want to go, that's the best you got. Man, that's so pathetic. Sorry, Franklin, I'm not a fantasy guy or the fairy guy. Sorry, but I can't join you in there. Cause you see, I gotta take a man at the shopping as well. Jesus! So that's hope you doing? understand. Oh, yeah. Shit. Are you kidding, oh, Dad? The... Are you out of your mind? I know you're not a fantasy guy, but Danny is offering us a trip to Disneyland. How could you say no to him? Yeah, Jimmy's right, Dad. Have you lost your freaking mind? No one says no to Disneyland. Just accept you, I guess. Well, whatever the case is, I and Jimmy are going to join Franklin and this family in this Disneyland trip, whether you like it or not. j Dog likes. J Dog likes a lot. Thank you. You're nice. Okay, I don't care. Do whatever the hell you want. It's actually a good thing. Because I, Amanda, will finally get some alone time for ourselves. Oh, yes, 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 yes! We got our recruits, man. This is awesome. All right, big bro Jimmy and big sis Tracy, let's do this thing. All right, Jimmy, get in the vehicle. I will be driving the car. Now hurry up, don't be slow. I can't wait to see Disneyland. Oh, yes, I can't wait for that, too. This is going to be a fun time for sure. All right, Disneyland, we are all coming. All right, my guys have fun. Please don't come back early to haul. Take all the time you need, leave me and your mom alone by now. All right, Benjamin, we got your recruits. Ain't this just awesome? Now let's head back home and see if your mom is finished with her work or not. Just let's hope for the best. Woohoo, yes! Don't worry, Dad, I'm sure that she must have finished with her work. She will join us, I'm 100% sure about it. All right, guys, I have finished up with all of my work. Now I feel good. Oh, yeah, baby. And it's all thanks to you and the viewer's power. I have arranged everything at its rightful places. And now I can enjoy the trip 
trip with all of you. Oh, no, no. Wait a minute, oh, is Tracy and Jimmy are going to y'all. join us in this as well? Hell yeah. This is the life. Man, now that's what I'm oh, talking yeah. about. Let's get going, oh, Franklin. Oh, yeah, that's what I love to hear. But may my angel, are you sure that you want to ride that? Yeah, of course. Why is something wrong with this, Franklin? Nope, nothing wrong at all. You look amazing. All right, you guys follow me. Let's get this party started. Now, this is going to be a hell of a ride. Hey, Benjamin, tell me, what was your New Year resolution for 2024? Ah, uh, man, never really gave in thought about that. But let's just say my resolution this year is surpassing you and your crimes. What the hell, Benjamin? Tell me that this was a joke, Hey, hey, right? hey, chill down. Don't need to get worked up, Dad. Yeah, I was joking. And at last, Franklin, Benjamin, and Jimmy, and Tracy all were at Disneyland. Oh, la, la, la. Hell yeah. Oh, this shit. looks so uh -oh. wonderful and beautiful. Oh, J-Dog likes. J-Dog likes a lot. Do that Can't dip. All right, guys, good. I'm going now! Oh, Follow me yeah. if you don't want to miss out Damn. all the fun! <laughs> at last, we are finally here at Disneyland! Woohoo, now this is what I love! All right, guys, let's do some kart racing! That's what I'm talking about! Uh-huh! Yeah. Come on! Let's go! Yeah. Yeah. Spending my time with my family, like yeah. a kid, is what I love the most! Man, this is go all I needed though. to kick off go New Year! Dog. J Dog Gun done it. Oh shit, this is really creepy. Hey, let's get out of here before the light turns off. Hi, 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 let's get going already, Dad. I don't want to be here. Listen to that music, man. This feels what creepy. Fuck? Oh. What in the oh, hell's going on now? Oh, fuck me. Just shut up already. You can't fool me. Hey, all right, guys, that's enough. Let's get going now. They used some diversion in there, so we could be busy on that, and in the meanwhile they get a chance to sneak up behind us to scare us like that. Such a childish thing. Guess me, it's a monster when it comes to stuff like this. Well, my act was top-notch. Kids really thought I was scared as well. Damn that women! So much for being a ghost face! And later Franklin, May, Benjamin, Tracy, and Jimmy had fun with their favorite Disney characters. Hot Everyone dog. wear happy most awful Jimmy, Tracy, and Benjamin. Dog. Dog. Yeah. 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 Come on! Let's go! Oh, yes, 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 yes! This is the best trip ever! <laughs> this flying carpet is really awesome. So this is it for today, guys. Thanks for watching us. Please make sure to like, share, and subscribe. And we will see you all later in our next video. Have fun. Bye, everyone. Oh, I better get going too, or else I will miss out some more fun. Hello guys, welcome back to my channel Osprey Gaming. As you can see, Franklin has turned his house from looking like this into looking like a super mansion. Later he even turned his car from looking like this into looking like a million bucks car. And then he later even upgraded his bike from looking like this into this super cool looking bike. And heck later he purchased a big beautiful mansion worth of three million dollars. And then again Franklin and his kid purchased a super car. Which was kind of off bad for them unfortunately. Cause the car was cursed. But now they have moved on from that. And now they have their eyes set on some super sea sailing boats. So without ado, let's hear it from Franklin and Benjamin. Oh yeah, I just love this. Man, this are some fine looking bows for sure. I wonder, can I purchase this or not? Hello, sir. I hope you are doing good today. So how can I help you with? Are you fascinated by the boats, huh? Do you want to purchase one? Oh yeah, absolutely, I'm fascinated. And yeah, of course, I would love that to have in my arsenal. But tell me, homie, how much is that big beauty over there worth? Oh, off? that one, eh? Her name is Sailing Sweet Blue Santos. And that is worth of $700,000. That right there is the best boat you can sail all of Los Santos with Oh yeah, with hell ease. yeah. A boat which can sail all of Los Santos with ease. Oh man, just what I needed. But dog, tell us some affordable price so we can purchase that sweet Santos. Please make it $500,000 or right, I less. need all the cash that I can get for now. I'm um, okay, you got yourself a deal, but just on one condition, and that is tell your viewers to like, share, and subscribe to the video and the channel. Oh, yes, 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 yes! Quite a nice deal for sure. Hey guys, whoever is watching this video, then please make sure to like, share, and subscribe to the channel and the video. So we can get the ceiling blue sweet Santos for $500,000. Pretty please guys do it. Oh, uh, that was quite good. All right, homie, consider this boat just for $500,000 just for you. 
But let me tell you this, I need the full money by tomorrow evening. And if you fail, then you can say the boat goodbye. I mean, if someone pays me good more than you, oh, then yeah. I would have no choice left but to sell that. them. So I hope you understand. And now get going, you just have 28 hours left. Sure thing. Thank you for understanding us. Don't worry, we won't disappoint you. We will get the money by tomorrow evening. Hey, let's go, son, and make that cash so we can sail the sea with our new boat. Oh, yes, 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 Dad. Man, this is going to be fun for sure. The next day. Oh, shit, shit, shit. Damn. Why, oh, why? You are shitting me. You gotta be kidding me. All the boats have sold out. There's just our sailing blue sweet Santos left. I guess we might have got lucky, but not for long. Damn, we gotta hurry, yeah, Benjamin. Yeah, you are right. It's a good thing that no one has thought of purchasing that boat for now just except for us. So we gotta hurry before someone decided to purchase that boat. But damn, we just have $300,000 for now. We still need 200000 and we have just left seven hours. Hey, Dad, have you got any friend who can lend us that yeah, money? Yeah, I got some. But you know how they are. They always deny us and make some silly reason, eh? So going in there won't do us any good. Just need to think of someone else who can help us with that money. Come on, Franklin, thank, thank, thank. Yeah, I know how they are, but we need them right now more than anything. So let's us go and ask them again. Who knows, they might even help us. And if they won't, then they sure must have a job that will suit our needs. Yeah, I guess you are right, son. Let us go now and make those money. And making $200,000 won't be hard, because we are back on the track, baby. We once again have started doing heists. Oh, jeez. What are this father and son duo up to now? Just let's hope they don't do anything bad. Oh, yeah, we are back to our old self. Now earning $200,000 ain't a big deal. Just do one heist and everything is ours for the taking. But let's just hope that mom doesn't find out about this like the last time with Simeon. Oh, uh, that ain't gonna happen again, son. I promise you that. From now, whatever we do, we will do it with a great plan. Not like the last time. All right, we are here at Trevor's house. Let us go and try lending the money from him. He has always denied us for everything. Let's hope that he helps us today. Yeah, let's cross our fingers and wish for the best. You may never know expect the unexpected. Oh, shit! What the? Whoop, pay de do, pay de do, do, do. What's this sound all about, eh? Looks like Trevor is having fun with Velvet. But damn, they are too loud. Hey, Trevor, open the door, buddy. It's me, Franklin. And please keep the noise down, please. Because, man, Benjamin is right here with me. Come on, open the door. I need to have a talk Ow. with you. Oh, oh shit, shit, shit. Oh, come uh, on, not them again. Uh, 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 oh, yes. Ah, oh, Franklin! You uh, bastard, how dare you ruin every moment uh, of ours? Uh, Why do you always disturb us when we are doing something good? What is that you want, bastard? It's always the same thing with you money, this money, that. For goddamn sake, just leave us alone when we are making new mini Trevors. Oh, oh, I'm sorry about that. Sorry for ruining your and Velvet's mood. Just forgive me, I won't disturb you again. You know what, have the time of your lives. Have fun, see you guys later. Yeah, we will, we will, you bastard. Bastard. Now get going, don't you dare eavesdrop us. Um, oh, Trevor, you. baby, let's do it from yeah. start, okay? Jeez, Benjamin, you know what Trevor was doing? Man, I thought that you wouldn't know about that just because you're 12. But damn, you are really clever. Uh, yeah, I have known him for years now, and this is the least that I can expect of... Oh, well, as you said, let them have at it. And hey, father, about what I said earlier, anyone else that you got in your mind? You see, Benjamin, Michael has helped us a lot of times. And as you know, he was the one who gave us the money for our car upgrade. And then he later gave us a heist of stealing the art paintings. And I did that, and then with that money, we purchased our new big mansion. So it's about time we get going to him. Who knows, he might help us again with those dollars. Ha ha ha, la la la. Oh, hello there, Franklin and Benjamin. So what are you guys here for, eh? Is there something that I can help you with? Yes, of course, dawg. You see, Mikey, we have just thought of purchasing a new boat which is worth $500,000. And unfortunately, we just have $300,000 with us. So it would be nice if lend us the rest of the amount. I promise I will pay you back with interest. Uh -huh, so the money is the issue, huh? Aha, uh -huh, you see, Franklin, my finances are like a grand theft auto heist, always disappearing without a trace. I'm practically living in a financial no wanted level zone right what the, now. What you say? I mean, I'm sorry I can't Whatever help you, you for now, like cool. always, because I myself don't Ain't have that, that cool. much for now. And nor do I have a heist for you that could make you so much dollars. I hope you understand, Franklin. Yeah, we understand, dawg. Well, as always, thank you for your time, Mike. Yeah, sure thing, Franklin and Benjamin. And once again, sorry to disappoint you both. And yeah, good luck purchasing that boat. Whoa.
Yeah, goodbye, Uncle Mike. So, Dad, what do we do now? Uncle Mike was our best last resort, and even he doesn't have what it takes to help us. Now, what can we do? I mean, what is there that we can do? I mean, how will we do? What, what, hey, what, hey, what? hey, hey, just call me if down. We have to steal your bro Lamar. So keep it down, okay? He always has an heist, and I'm sure that he must have one now. So let us call him first. So what's the deal? Why didn't Lamar call us here at this location? Hey, where is he anyway? Hey, Dad, look, bro, Lamar is over there. Oh, yeah, I see him now. Hey, hello there, Lamar, homie. Whoa, bro, 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 bro. If isn't my homie Franklin and Benjamin. Man, I'm so glad to see the both of you. Yeah, same here as well, Lamar, bro. Hey, 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 Lamar, so what's the deal, dawg? Just as soon as we called you, you ordered us to get here ASAP. So what now, hey? Looks like nothing special is going on or whatsoever. We got no time to waste. We got our two hundred thousand dollars before First the off, end of the I'll day. First just shut up, Franklin. And second, I heard that you guys made it come back to heist. So I just want to say that welcome back. We are happy to have you back. And third, you need money. I got money. But to earn that, we got to do in heist. And today we are about to steal a train which has been exporting and importing golds. So what do you say, Franklin? You up for this job, homie, or what? Hell yeah. Oh yeah. It's just, just what I needed. All right, homie, let's do this thing. I'm all in for this one. Oh, yes, 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 yes! We are going to a train heist! Man, that's so damn cool! Let's do this thing even I'm all yeah, in for no this! Yeah, but no thanks, Benjamin. You are not going to join us, because that's going to be a danger mission. I don't want you to get involved in jeopardizing the heist for us. So you are going to stay right at my house and wait for us until we get back okay. Yeah, Lamar's absolutely right. I don't want you getting hurt in the process as well. So as Lamar said, you are going to wait us right at Lamar's house until we uh, get back from man, the mission. man, that's so not cool but still i appreciate all of your concern so i will stay back and a yeah good luck guys later. oh this is the place all right lamar has explained me everything so i better do this quick first gotta pass through all these guards it's about time for stealth kills come on franklin you got this you got this all right one down and for more to go come on franklin nice and slow nice and slow all right Yeah, now that's what I'm talking about. Here we go, second one down. It's a good thing I use suppressor on my pistol to reduce the sound. Look at that. All right, Franklin, homie, first you gotta knock all those guards who are watching over that place. And when you succeed in that, then get inside and then you hack the system and open the cell. And then later give the train a signal so it could start moving. Okay, sure thing, I got that. But tell me, Lamar, what's all of your part? Are you just gonna stand and wait over here? What, ain't you guys gonna help me anything? Of course we have part in this mission as well. You see, I will be the one to steal the golds from the container. And this man's right here, I've hired them for helping us. Cause you see there are way too many guards than you can even expect off. You will find that firsthand when the train arrives. For now I can just wish you luck. Look at that! There you go! Look at that! Ah, what in the hell is Come going on? Shut your mouth, Popo. <laughs> still think you are, nigga? Oh, you still got scraps, huh? I guess that settles that. All right, it's time to get in and hack the system. I got this. Come on, now. Let's go. You got this, Franklin. You got this. Need to open the damn cell and give the signal to the train to merge forward. All right, looks like it's all done over here. Better give the train a signal. Look at that. Let's go. All right, then. All right, I'm all done here. Better head outside. More moments later. All right, looks like Franklin has succeeded. Man, well done, Franklin, my homie. It's about time we join the shootout, too. Here you go, suckers. Bring all you got. No one ain't gonna stop us from stealing that gold. Come on, yeah, that's what I'm talking about. You want me, huh? Then kill me. And there you go! It's time for the rocket launchers, baby! Oh man, now this is awesome! Guess Lamar was right about the guards thing! Damn, those busters are way too many! But this ain't gonna stop me! I knew you was punk! You happy now? You punk-ass bitches done now? How you not see me? Hey, fuck! You still hard, huh? Who you think you fight, fool? Oh, no! No! Oh, shit! 
you think you are, nigga? Guess Franklin and my guys will handle the rest. I better steal all the golds before some more of this guard show up. All right, there it is. Gold, sweet gold, I love it. Uh, let's get this baby's packing. Now this right here is absolutely amazing. Yo, 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 yo! Well done, homie Franklin. Hurry up, get on the wheels before any more of this punk show up. Let's get the F out of here, homie! Oh, yeah, hell yeah! At last, this mission is a success. Now I can get the money to purchase that beautiful boat. Man, this is gonna be fun for sure. Man, that shit right there was wild. I can't believe that we pulled it off. Man, that was crazy. I'm really glad to have you back, Franklin. Now we will keep on rolling like the big dude and we are. Ha 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 Los Santos is ours for the taking now. Yeah, Dad, you did it! Man, I'm so proud of the both of you. You guys teaming is always a success. Yeah, you sure are right about that, Benjamin. Here you go, Franklin, the $200,000. That's cool. You have earned it. Yeah, thanks a lot. All right, Benjamin, my son, let us get going. We are running out of time. We only have one all left, so let's get going and purchase that boat. Hey, Dad, let's do this thing. Hey, one more thing, Franklin. Before you go, tell me this. You're open up for more jobs like this, aren't you? Michelle. Because I will be needing you for future yeah. heists. Oh, yeah, uh -huh. baby. This is just what I wanted you and me rolling it again. Ain't this fun? Hell yeah. One hour later. And just like this, Franklin acquired the money that he needed. And after all the paperwork and documents, now this boat officially belonged to Franklin and his family. So let's hear it from them. Well done, homie. You kept your word and didn't disappoint me. Now this sailing sweet blue Santos belongs to you. The sea's yours to conquer now. Have fun with it. Hey, driver, let us get going now. Oh, yes, 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 yes. We are going to sail through whole Los Santos with that. This is going to be awesome for sure. Hey, Franklin, tell me one thing. Where did you get those money to purchase this boat? What are you doing, A.E.? First upgrading the cars and bike, then later purchasing a new supercar. And again with a mansion. And now again with a boat. The list keeps going on and on. Don't tell me that you're doing those criminal shits again to earn all the money. Oh, shit, shit, shit. No, Mom, no. <laughs> Oh, no, man, no! Oh, shit! Shit, no! This money, you say? This are all the stock investment that I had made in the past. And sometimes I lend money from my friends. You can't ask Benjamin or even Lamar. He was the one paid us for this boat. I promise we ain't doing anything wrong behind your back, sweetie. Please have some faith in us, darling. Yeah, Mom, Dad is 100% right. Have faith in us, we ain't doing any bad stuff behind your back. Oh, oh, I'm sorry about that. Guess I should have trusted you more than that. And I'm happy to hear that you're not doing that criminal stuffs anymore. Hell yeah. Oh yeah. All right, guys, since everything is clear between us, how about we hop in, in our new boat known as the Sailing Sweet Blue Santos and take that for a ride. Come on, let us get going. This is gonna be a heaven of a ride. Oh yeah. Yes, Dad, yes! I like the sound of that! Let's freaking do this! Oh yeah? Hell yeah, baby! Yeah. Let's start rolling yeah. Franklin and Benjamin! Oh, this oh, is sure oh. going to be an awesome collection for our new mansion! We got boats now, including with cars and bikes! Nice ride, me my sweetheart! Come on, hold on tight to your seat, you guys! Cause the ride is going to be bumpy! Yeah, Dad! But this is not a car to get bumpy! But still, I love that line! Come on, Dad! Sail it more faster, faster! Yeah, and now this is what I'm talking about! So how about this, you guys? Are you having fun now? Yes, yes, yes! Of course we are having fun! And once again, Franklin and Benjamin lied to me and escaped. But how long they can hide the truth from her, at one point she will find out the truth. But only time could tell when. So this is it for today, guys. Thanks for watching. Please like, share, and subscribe. And I will see you all later in my next video. Until then, bye, peace, relax, and have fun. Thank you for the wait, guys. And yeah, thank you for coming on such short notice. You see, the day is finally here. It's now or never. So without ado, here let's start. Why, hello. Oh yeah, hell yeah. Let's do this thing. Man, I have been waiting for this moment for months. Hurry up, tell us the plan yeah, okay, already. Okay, okay, Attention towards the TV screen, guys. 
You see, after a lot of thinking I had come up with this. The car that we wanted for years is finally here in Los Santos, and it's right here in this place. Dad, come on, really? You could have done this on a board instead of the TV. This is so unprofessional. Yeah, I sure agree on this with Big Bro Jimmy. This really isn't that great. I would prefer a board plan heist instead First of a TV. First of all, TV. just shut up and don't you interrupt me again when I'm speaking. And yeah, if you don't like this, then I can't help it. What age are you living on, eh? This is 2020 for board plan heist or old now. This is what we are going from today onwards. Okay, okay, Uncle Mike, we got you. You can call on now. Um, now where was I? Oh yeah, I remember now. Here, this are some of the car pictures that I gathered. Oh, la la, isn't this just awesome? I'm Look, a car at its die. finest. When will it end? When will it end? <sighs> yeah, I agree with you on this as well, Jimmy, bro. Yeah? 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 Just stop this, you bastards. Why can't you just shut your ass for a few minutes? Is that really that hard to do? Man, Franklin, you shouldn't have bought your son here. And yeah, Jimmy, if this that boring to you, then why not go and play your games? Whoa. I'm not the one who called you. <laughs> You yourself are the what? one who decided to be oh, here. Uh -huh. Wow! You got something to oh, say! Oh no, 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 man! We are sorry about that, Uncle Mike. Okay, if you say so, but don't do that again. All right, guys, here are some of the intel I have gathered. Look, these are the pictures of the car. This car is right here in that place from one month. But I was just able to gather some of the photos. And look, these are the guards. We gotta be careful around them. There are tones of them, so we gotta be careful. And this is guy who owns the car. So we get there and we destroy them and then we rob the car. So how about that, you guys? Pretty cool, right? I like this. Rolling with the homies. Oh, yes, 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 yes. I like this plan. All right, we are all in. Let's do this thing. I can't wait to get my hands on oh, that car. Fuck that. Man, that is total bullshit. Fool. Man, I knew you was a loser. Really, Michael, what the hell are you thinking? This is like a do or die mission after months of planning. Is this the crap that you came up with? That's the best you got? Loser. You're shitty at this. Uh, I see, so you don't like the plan, eh? All right, then tell me your plans. Let me hear you out. Tell me what should we do, How Should we steal the car? Come on, geniuses, show me what you got. Uh -huh. Oh, what's wrong? You don't have one. Is nah. this all you can mutter? Come on no. now, what's the deal? Whatever, you real cool. I guess this is okay, Michael. This really is a nice plan. I think I can work with this. Yeah, now that I look this carefully, this is really good. I think I can work on with this just like Franklin. Okay, yeah, that's right. This. Just what I expected. Yo, you just talked big. Big gone big. J Dog gun done it. The fat kid's only gone and done it. Woohoo! Oh, yeah. Let's start rolling, baby. All of us working together now. There's no stopping ah, us. No! Hey, hey, just stop it. Don't you fools get excited. You are not joining us. You will stay right here. This is a risky mission, and I don't want to jeopardy this plan. I can't risk it, you know. So it's. I want to go. Pretty please, Dad. Please let me join you in this house. Yeah, Benjamin, I think Michael is right. So it's best that you stay at house. You just keep a watch over your mom. Just don't let her find out about this. And let us handle the rest, okay? Oh, what the? Come on, Dad. Pretty please let me join hey, you. Hey, don't argue, Benjamin. This is not a walk in park. We will be surrounded by killers. And I don't want you joining us and getting hurt or worse in the process. You are still not ready for the big leagues. So please understand, my son. Yeah, okay, okay, Dad. I guess you are right, so I will stay in house. And don't worry about mom, I will handle her. Oh, dad, please! No, no, no! Oh, Franklin, my brother, no! Come dad, on, guys, please no. don't do this. Take me along Mess with you. Mouth, po -po. Jimmy, my homie, don't get the wrong idea. But well, Michael is right, I can't argue with that. So please stay right here, okay? I don't care. I just want to have fun with you all. So please, yeah. please, please, yeah. let me Fucking join you. Yeah. You bastard, how many times do I have to say you that it's not your game where you are looking to have fun? This is the real deal. Fuck! You, know, oh, you suck, Dad. I hate you. I really, really hate you. Oh, poor Jimmy. Hey, Mike, don't worry. I'm sure you will understand this later. Hey, Dad, Uncle Mike, don't worry about Big Bro Jimmy. I will make him understand. You guys can carry on with your heist. Yeah, please do that, Benjamin. All right, guys, we are here. Be prepared. As soon as we get there, we take them all down. Oh, yeah, baby. Oh, yeah. Hey, who in the hell are you guys? This suckers look sketchy as hell to me. Oh, shit, shit, watch out for the bullet, guys. Oh, no, oh, God, no, no, no. Kill me! Ain't this a barrel of fun? Yeah? Yeah? Come on, motherfucker, shoot me back! 
get here. You still think you are, nigga? Oh, you want to keep getting down? Damn, oh, so you ain't on your deck, right? All of them, get this punk-ass sucker. Don't let any of them escape. Shit, I said it wouldn't be nothing. Any more you want? I guess not. I guess that's that. guards to take out. We are done, guys, all right? Hurry up and get in the car ASAP. Come on, let's go, everybody. Mike, you get in the other car and meet us back in our hideout. Trevor, you come with me, let's do this now shit. Now that's what I'm talking. Oh, crap, not this alarm. Hey, Franklin, do something about it. Oh, no, here comes more of this punks. Hello, this is 911. Hey, 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 officers, I need your help. Please help me, some sketchy folks are here. I don't know who they are, but they are wearing prisoners' outfit and a cop outfit. And they are, are destroying up my guards. Mikey, take the other route. Don't worry about the cops. Their attention will be solely on us. Just escape and meet us back in our hideout. <laughs> yeah, that's right. Listen, bulletproof armored vehicle. You can't even touch us. I hear funeral punks. Oh, yeah, that's right. Try all you want, but you will Just never like this catch Just like this Franklin and Trevor escape. On the other hand, Mikey reached the hideout with no single scratch. Because Franklin and Trevor had all the cops' attention on them. So let's see what happens next in this story. Man, oh man! I can't believe that we pulled it off. Here you go, Franklin. Hell yeah! Oh yeah! This is the life. <laughs> wow! Oh man, I love this crap. <laughs> All right, guys. Now we stay low for a few days. Don't do anything that draws the cops' attention on us. <laughs> mm. Oh yeah, sure thing. Now let's party. Come on with me. I like, I like to party, party, party. I like to party, party. Mm. You see that? Whoa, whoa, man, would you look at that? Look who's here. It is my son, Benjamin. All right, now this is what I'm talking about. Come and join us, son. Let's party. Oh, yes, 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 yes. <laughs> oh, my gosh. This looks so freaking cool. Man, this car is awesome. I just love it. Of course it's awesome, my son. That's more all the reason why we stole this. Hey, and wait a minute, Franklin. I'm sorry, but I would like you to stop. Hey, Benjamin, tell me. Nobody saw you getting in here, right? As you know, we like to keep things secret. Oh, yeah, about that. I'm sorry, Dad, Uncle Mike, and Trevor. Good Lord. You see, I'm not here by myself. I was forced here by someone to show your hideout, oh, and that fuck. someone is Mom. Even Damn. she is here with me alongside with some Shit. folks that you what don't like, hell? and that's the cops. What the... What the fuck? Hey, what? This is a joke, right, Benjamin, son? Oh, uh -huh, no way! All right, guys, corner these fools and pin them down! Go, 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 go! Don't let any of these bastards escape! Oh, my good lord, what's the meaning of this, Benjamin? Oh, you will find that out soon enough! All right, you bastards, we have surrounded you from everywhere, don't you dare do something foolish! Everyone on your knees, come on, do it now! Oh, god damn, I will shoot the bullets right through your okay, chest! Okay, okay, officers, we will do as you say! Just please don't shoot us! Benjamin, what's this all about? What does this mean? Why are the cops and your mom here with you? How did they know our hideout? Yeah, first off, well, I'm sorry, Dad. All right, it's better that I give an explanation. You see, I was bribed by Mom. Here's what went down between us. As usual, I was playing my games, and this is what happened. Where is Franklin? He should have returned by now. It's almost getting dark, and even his phone is switched off. He never puts his phone on sleep, unless he is on a heist or doing something bad. Don't tell me that he is back with that shit again. I don't like him doing criminal things. Or maybe he was just lying to me the whole time, just pretending to be a good guy. That he has left all this crimes. Maybe he is still doing that shit behind my back. Hey, Benjamin, where's your dad at? He was with you, wasn't he? Why oh, hasn't oh, he come home yet? Oh, wait a minute, Mom. Do you know something about games. it? Please don't disturb me with your talks. 
Yeah, that's cool. Here I you go. I don't care what yeah, you are nice. doing. Just tell me now. Where's your dad? Come on, speak up now. Or I won't let you play any more games. Oh, shit, shit, shit. Mom, I just lost because of you. You really screwed me on this one. Why can't you just shut up for once for what God's sake? What was that, Benjamin? Sake? What did you just say to me? Don't you dare annoy me. I don't care if you lost and heck, there's nothing you can do about it. And now tell me, where's your dad and why hasn't he returned home yet? Oh, oh, I totally forgot to say this. He is staying off night at Uncle Michael's house today. He told me to inform you, but I forgot to tell you because I was busy and playing games. Now just let me enjoy my games, Mom. Please don't disturb me, okay? I told what you needed to I know. I don't believe this. If that were to be the case, then he would have told that by himself. Guess Benjamin knows what his dad is up to and he doesn't want me to find this out. He is lying to me. He is surely hiding something. Just to save his dad's ass. Well, I know how to make you work, Benjamin. After all, I'm your mother. Maybe this will do the trick. Hey, Benjamin, I see you are playing old games still now. First with Tekken 7 and now WWE to K23. You know, Tekken 8 is out right and many more games. Final Fantasy 7 Rebirth, Hell Divers 2. I know you are a big fighting game fan. And upcoming month, there's a new installment coming to WWE, right? So why play this old game still now? Yeah, I would have loved to get all those games. I spend it all my pocket money in something or the other, and now I don't have any penny left to even purchase oh, a Benjamin, single game. Oh, Benjamin, say like that. After all, why is your mom here for any way? You want games? Go purchase games. I will give you the money that you need. You know what? Here, take this $500 and go purchase every single game that I mentioned. Go pre-order it and go purchase it from the nearby store. At the end of the day, I just want Howling? my son to be happy. Oh my happy. gosh! Are you really, really, really serious about this, Mom? Do you really freaking mean that? Man, this is like a miracle! Looks like it's my best yes, day of today! Yes, of course I mean that from the bottom of my heart, Benjamin. At the end of the day, it's all up to Mom to keep their son happy. Oh, yes, 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 yes! Rookity doo but he do 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 Looks like today is really my best day. All right, Mom, hand me those more, uh -huh, more money. No, 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 not so easily, Benjamin. I will hand you this money just on one condition. Tell me about your dad. Tell me all this whereabouts, and tell me where is he now. Oh, man, not this again. Okay, okay, Mom, I will tell you everything. But promise me that you will hand me those money after yeah, I tell you everything. Yeah, of course your thing, my son. I will do as you say, but I want to know everything. And that is what went down between us. She bribed me, Dad. And you know what the worst part is? She didn't even hand me those $500. Yeah, I did what was right. I bribed him, which was actually good for something. I have told you numerous times to stop doing this criminal shit. But looks like you didn't took that seriously. You were doing this behind my back for so long. And I just couldn't ignore that. You deserve this, Franklin. You deserve this. I'm sorry, officers, I'm sorry. Hey, Benjamin, how did the cops find out our hideout? Oh, you will find that soon enough. You will be explained everything in the prison. All right, you bastards, move, get going to the car. Don't you dare resist or you will suffer. Franklin, that's the reason why I don't open about my secrets to Jimmy or Tracy. Look where that trust has gotten us now. I'm sorry, Mikey, I'm sorry, Trevor. He really sold us out, but I never thought he would do that. Damn you, Benjamin, damn you! And just like this, the cops gotta hold off Michael Franklin and Trevor's secret whereabouts, and they were arrested for their crime. But still, this was not explained. Looks like we will have to wait and find that out, so keep watching you all. Let's see what happens next in this story. And later the cops informed Michael's family and Trevor's family about this, and now they are all here. And some cops took that stolen vehicle back to its owner safe and sound. So without ado, let's hear it from Thanks them. a lot, officers. You guys are really the hope of Los Santos. Make sure you teach those punk ass a lesson of their lifetime. Oh, don't you worry about that. Our top officers are dealing with them. They sure will teach them a good lesson for sure. All right, officer, let us get going now. Our job over here is done. No, oh, you do not! Don't you dare think about doing that! Oh, I pity you, dude. Blame Oh, man, it's a good thing that I didn't join you, fools. Or I could end it up in your shoes.
Man, I only got lucky in for you fools. Guess it was your bad I'm luck. I'm really, I... really, really sorry, Dad. Hope you find a place in your heart to forgive me for what I did. Oh, Trevor, my baby, you got arrested. You still do heist. What a pleasant surprise to find that out, man. I'm so happy. I like your this style, too. I love everything about you, honey. It doesn't matter if it's good or bad. And yeah, um, think about it to lovers meeting in a prison. Oh, doesn't that sound uh, cool? See? You love your old Trevi poo, don't ya? Ha 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 Oh, yes, I knew you would like this. Everything I do is cool for you, ain't that right, baby girl? Oh, yeah. You said it, oh, Trevor, shit, honey. I can't believe this couple. <laughs> Trevor has really turned Velvet into a psycho as well after their engagement, even if he sleeps with some other women in front of her. Even that is cool for her. They both have turned oh, into psycho. What the? Oh, shit. What the hell is the meaning of this, mate? Don't tell me what I think it is. Yeah, it is what you think it is, Franklin. And I mean, you really deserve this. You see, this is what happened. Damn it, who in the hell were they? A guy with a cop outfit and a mask and others with prisoner's outfit. Who could be behind those masks? Why steal now when we are so full with our hands on different cases? Damn them all, damn them. Yeah, who could those men be? Um, I'm trying to figure out, but damn, I can't get anything out of my head. It sure wouldn't be Franklin. Cause we have arrested him way many times that we can even remember ourselves. Nor it would be Michael and Trevor. Cause we've done the same with them as well. So could be behind this one. And that is when May and Benjamin showed up to the police station and explained us everything that we needed to know. And yeah, they were so nice that they even showed us your goodbye, hideout. Goodbye, Dad. That is what went down between us. And yeah, goodbye, us. Franklin and Trevor. <laughs> hey, May, I just want to say, don't you be ashamed of yourself. You did exactly what you needed to do as a good mother and as a good wife. They were really getting to the bad side. It's a good thing you stopped them in time. And for that, I'm why? really proud why, of you. Why, 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 why? What's wrong why with you, you, you wit? I did it all for you and Benjamin. I don't want my husband and my kid to get on the bad side. That's all the reason why I informed the cops about you all. First, you upgrade your car, and then a new car. And then later, a big new mansion in which we are currently staying. And then again, a new boat. And whenever I asked you about where you got the money, you and just laughed mansion. it on my... And now again with a boat. The list keeps going on and on. Don't tell me that you're doing those criminal shits again. To Shit, no! This money, you say, this are all the stock investment that I had made in the past. And sometimes I lend money from my friends. You can't ask Benjamin or even Lamar. He was the one paid us for this boat. I promise we ain't doing anything wrong behind your back, sweet. Please have some faith in us, darling. You just laughed it on my face and lied to me every single time. You were doing this criminal shit. That's the reason why you got all the money right. And I couldn't take this anymore. And as soon as I knew you were doing the same shit, I couldn't help myself but to tell the cops. Now it's better that you be here and be punished for your sin. In, like a real man does. Hope you change when you get out of the prison. I will be happy to learn your progress from Officer Sean. Now by Franklin, see you later in five months. Hey, Officer, make sure you send him as a changed man. Bye bye, Dad. Hey, baby, soon. let me give you smooch before you go. Oh, yes, just what I needed. Ah, oh, this feels so good. All right, Trevor, honey. Don't you worry about anything. I will come here to meet you every single day. Just make sure you give me super umta smooch just like this, and make sure you be ready to give me the riding of my lifetime. I need five months ride in just one day, and that day is when you get out from the prison. Bye, honey. See you tomorrow when I come to meet you. Well, you're a sweet girl, ain't you? Oh, my. Thanks a lot, my sweet velvet. And yeah, don't worry, I will be ready for you. All right, you bastards have been sentenced for five months prison. Hope that changes something in you. And yeah, be prepared, cause in this five months, we will make you see the hell himself. All right, officer, let us get going now. Let them suffer for what they've done. Go on, go on, go on, go on. In our criminal world, there's no one that we can trust on. That's the reason why I never showed our hideout to my family. But you, on the other hand, whoa, oh, whoa, you trusted Benjamin. And now look where that trust has gotten all of us. He sold us out just for a bribe of $500. I'm really sorry about my son. Please forgive me, Michael and Trevor. Oh, well, there's nothing we can do now. Might as well enjoy the prison life. Many months later. Fast forward to five months later. They were all freed from prison. Ah, uh, man, the fresh air. Back to home sweet home. Yeah, this feels nice, right, Michael? So don't you dare ever do that shit again. Or else this time, if we catch you in anything, then you will be in for a very, very long time. Oh, yeah, don't you worry about that, officers. I have learned my lesson. I'm a changed man now, and I promise I won't do that things again. Yeah, good for you, Michael. Hope I never see you in a prison cell again. Ah, man, that was a long five ass months. Oh, I see no one is here to greet me, huh? Well, I guess I should have expected this. 
better that I go and make up to everyone. All right, guys, Big Daddy is in the house. Oh, right, yes, yes, on. yes! Trevor, honey, you are back. I'm so happy to see you, even though I saw you yesterday. But right here, this feels really good, because you are officially back to Hello, home, sweet sexy. home. I love beautiful. Ha 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 ha. Just what kind of reaction that I expected. Man, they all love me all right, baby. It's about time to give you the writings that I promised. Get over here, sweetheart. I love you. I love you. I love you. All right, I'm here. It's about time I get those bastards. For what they did, how dare they screw me and my friends. I will make them pay. Yes, your prison changes everyone, but not me. All those five months I have been thinking about is May. That how should I get my revenge on her? Well, it's about time for that. Hey, you punk Benjamin. Where is your witch mom and my wife tell me now? Where is she hiding? I'm here to make her pay oh for what gosh, she did. Oh my gosh, Dad. You are back. Oh, yes, 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 yes. Man, I'm so happy to see you. Hey, just stop that bastard. I don't like that anymore. Tell me, where is your mom? I will eat you alive! Hey, Franklin, I'm right here. If you gotta say something, then say it to my face. And yeah, don't you dare talk to Benjamin like that ever again. Oh, so there you are, eh? Get ready, you are going to pay now! What the hell? What is this all about? Why are you wearing a cop outfit? How dare you make fun of me cosplaying that? For your information, Franklin, I'm not cosplaying anyone, or nor do I making fun of you. I have officially joined the rank of officers. I'm one of them now. Can't you see it says Shira Nui? So what does this mean for Franklin and his family? Since they were not here for five months, a lot has happened. So where will this take us now? Guess we will have to wait and find that out. So this is it for today, guys. Thanks for watching. Please make sure to like, share, and subscribe. And I will see you all in my next video. Until then, bye, peace, relax, and have fun. I can't believe that she did this. I still can't get out of my head that my wife is a cop now. Oh, I just wish there could have been a time machine so I could just go back in the past and fix all of this from happening. But damn, I can't do this. I chose this fate, now it's time I face it like a man too. All right, Officer Shirano on duty. Oh, there he is. What's he daydreaming now? Hey, Franklin, don't you got a job to do instead of relaxing and just wasting your time? Oh, just shut up with you. Don't you dare teach me about that. I mean, how could you do this to me? The thing that I hated the most, you knew I hated the cops. But still, you had to go and join the cops for us, didn't you? Why, 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 you witch, why? After all the things I did for you and for this family, how could you betray me like this, my? How could you? How you say, well, that was easy. You bought this on yourself, Franklin. I said you multiple times to stop doing this criminal shit. But you didn't listen to me now, did you? You purchased this house, boat, and cars, everything from illegal money. And now we have come to this just because of you. Yeah, right. You say illegal, huh? Well, do you even know how much effort it takes to rob a bank or to even complete a single heist? No, I don't know that shit. And heck, I don't even want to know that anyway. I did what I had to do, Franklin. You were getting too deep into this criminal life. I had to do this for me, my son, and you. I did it all to protect our family. Protect our family? Ha 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 Isn't this funny? You say to protect our family, but you are actually the one who's ruining it by sending me to jail and for bribing our own son. Benjamin needed to understand the consequences of your actions. And now, I'm in a position to make sure you stay out of trouble. You better find yourself a good job and leave this criminal life of yours behind. Hey, look at me when I'm talking to you. Don't you dare ignore me. Yeah, that's good. Hear me carefully. Leave this criminal thing. Or else in every path of your way, you will be finding me with shackles waiting for you to be arrested. That's all I gotta say. It's all up to you, Franklin. Leave this shit criminally life behind. Or you will face consequences like never before. Yeah, yeah, whatever you say. Hey, say officer. Don't you got real criminals to chase? I heard that Los Santos has been in a mess from last few months, from robbing goals to robbing banks. Why are you here lecturing me? Why don't you go and do your thing? Officer, so call mine. Yeah, nice bluff, Franklin. Don't worry about them. I will handle all those criminals. Just like how I handled you by getting your ass arrested by the cops. That's it, I'm all done here. I will be taking my leave now. Cause unlike you, I don't have time to waste. I got criminals to catch. Think about what I said. Or you will be in real trouble, Franklin. By now, I will see you later. Oh, what the? You gotta be kidding me. That women, she has really left me no choice. Damn, how could this all get so terrible in just few months? Oh, this is so not cool. I just hate my ass, officer. I wish she turns back to her old self, the women that I cared and loved about. Well, I better go and think this carefully for now. Hey, Mikey, tough break, huh? I heard about Amanda, Tracy, and Jimmy from my wife. They all left you again, huh? 
well, this sucks really big time. We really messed it up, didn't we? But don't worry, we will find them together, I promise. I will help you all along the way until we found them. Thanks a lot, Trevor, my bud. At a time like this, that really means a lot. I appreciate it from the bottom of my heart. Yeah, I got you, bud, no props. Hey, tell me, Mikey, where could have they gone? Do you know any familiar particular place? Uh, Trevor, I don't know that. Last time when they left the house, I tried to bring up that many times. But they didn't say a word. Heck, morning, I tried to ask the neighbors, too. But do you know what they all did? They all rejected me. They denied me from saying anything. They all were giving me a cold look. As if I'm a goddamn killer. As if I'm a guy that who doesn't learn from his mistake. Yeah, they did that, damn those fools. We will get them one day, don't you worry about it. Enough about my sad story. What about you, Trevor? How's Velvet behavior with you since returning from the prison? Well, you know me and my wife, Velvet. We both are some pretty psycho couples. Nothing can separate us. She is still the same. Heck, when I returned back from home, they all gave me an hero's welcome. Ha 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 ha. Man, Velvet is really the best. And as you know, she used to come and meet us in the prison too. Unlike Franklin's wife, Mai, and everyone else. Oh, oh, speaking of that witch, Mai. What about that damn woman? This all would have not happened if this wasn't for her. Yeah, you are right. And since what I heard from my wife, she has joined the damn cop's force. She thinks she can escape us by being a cop. Then she sure is mistaking us for something else. Hey, Mikey, I have got a plan. We can get back at those who wronged us. No, this is not crazy. Believe me, this is the right thing. Franklin's wife, Mai. She is the key for all of this. We would have never gone in the prison if it wasn't for her like you said. She is the one who said everything due to the cops about our hideout, about the car and everything. So we take her down and we get our revenge. What do you say doesn't this sound great? No, 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 Trevor. What has gotten into you? Even if she did, then we can't kill her. We ain't that bud, and after all, she is Franklin's wife. What will happen if Franklin finds out about this, huh? You are angry and filled with rage now. So calm down and let's think this this through. I have thought this through over and over, Michael. She joining the cops is the worst thing that could happen to us. Wherever or whatever we would do the cops, I mean that damn Mai will be tailing us. She is really going to be a pain in the ass. So I say let's take her down before she gets one of us. And don't worry about Franklin. He himself will help us with this. Just you wait and watch. Frank, you there? Hey kid, it's your pal Trevor. Hey, meet me at Michael's house. I gotta talk to you about something. And make sure that when you get here, that no one's tailing you. Just shake them off, okay? Yeah, I got you, dog. I'm on my way. I will be there soon. Okay, okay. All right, that's done. Leave Franklin to me, Mikey. I will handle him. Okay, whatever you say, Trevor. All right, it's time to head out to my friend's place. Oh, look who it is. If ain't the little bastard who sold us out. Oh, you little punk. Hey, 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 Dad! Why are you ignoring me since you got out from the prison? I know I screwed up and I'm sorry for what happened, okay? I really do! Please talk to me, can't we just all forget about the past? And be like the father and son duo that we used to be? Come on, Dad, pretty please! Come on, take me with you so we can have fun together! Like we used to. Yeah, why, huh? So you can again be bribed by your mom and sell us again like you did the last time. Well, screw that. We can never go back in the past. What's done is done. You betrayed me and my trust, Benjamin. Just stop trying to make up to me, okay? Just leave me alone. I trusted you with my heart, but not anymore, son, not anymore. I'm leaving now, and when that witch comes back home, you can say her I'm off to a friend's place. Oh, come on, Dad. Let's all talk this over. I'm sure we can all come together at one point. Listen to me, Dad. Damn, Dad. I'm damning it all! Franklin really didn't need it to be rude on Benjamin. After all, he was tricked by Maya of all people. Well, what's gonna happen? Looks like Franklin's really in a pissed off mood. Will he accept Trevor's deal and take down Maya along with him? Cause it sure looks like he will accept it. But only time can tell. Keep watching you all. Let's see how this story unfolds. Well, so what do you guys wanted to talk about? Speak up, you know I'm going through a bad time as it is right. With all this cop's criminal shit that's been going on! Well, you don't need to worry about that anymore, Franklin. We got a solution for all of this problems. Let's cut the head of the snake. Oh, what? What do you mean by cut the head of the snake? Isn't it obvious, Franklin? I'm referring the snake as your wife. You know, she is the one who started this after all. If it wasn't for her, Mike's family would still be here with him. And heck, this ruined your relationship with your son as well. You bastard, how could you say that? You know I can't do this. I can't kill my wife, I can't do this, I just can't. How dare you bring this up at a time like this? Just calm down, Franklin. Think this through. We get her or she gets us. No, 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 stop saying that. Okay, okay, if not take her down, then how about this? 
Let's gather some evidence and prove that Maya is a corrupt officer. Let remove her from the officer's post. I understand that this is a tough decision to make, but still you need to make one. Either she gets us along with the cops, or we get her before they make a move. Just stop and let me thank all she ever wanted us to get out of that criminal life. And that's the reason why she did what she did. She joined the cops for us so we won't do this criminal shit anymore. And if that's what she want, then that's exactly what we are gonna do. Let's leave this life behind and start a new journey from here as the good guys that we are supposed to be. Let's all change together. And about Michael's family, we all will find them together. No matter where they have gone, we will find them all. Hello there, you guys. It's so nice to see you all. I really miss this. Lamar, what the hell are you doing over here? Tell me no one followed you around now, did they? No, not all. I'm good. No one's telling me around. Well, okay, that's good. So what about you here, Lamar? Well, I don't know how I should put this. But well, here goes nothing. I've come here to discuss something important. Important regarding about Franklin's wife, Mai. What about Mai? What are you talking about, Lamar? Come on, spill it. What's so important? Let me hear it, too. Okay, okay, Franklin, I will say it. But don't lose your cool, okay? Mai, Mai, that witch of a woman, she is betraying you. She is betraying you, Franklin. What do you mean by betraying me, huh? Is she cheating on me with some other man? No, Franklin, nothing of that matter. You won't get it like that. Here I will explain you everything that happened in the last five months when you all were in prison. Since you guys were in prison, this left a wide gang open. I mean, every criminal in Los Santos started robbing something or the other. From banks to robbing supercars. From hijacking gold containers from a train and much more. A big organization led by a single man. I still don't know that man's identity, because he always covers up his face. What are implying Lamar? What has this got to do with my... This has everything thing to do with her. You see, wherever all this robbing took place, I was present with her team at the moment. But every time they outsmarted the cops and escaped them. Do you know why? Why you tell me why? Because my works for those big organization gangs. What the? No, 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 no way. You are lying, Lamar. I don't believe you. This is bullshit. No, Franklin, no, homie, no. This is not bullshit. I'm telling you the truth. Wrong, Franklin. You have mistaken her. She's just playing with you. The reason why she joined the cops is so she could give her organization and tell about the cops' next move. You see, you guys used to be the no one criminals of Los Santos, but now my and her organization is on the top. You three were a burden for her team and organization. That's the reason why she always said, you know, to do rob any banks or anything of that matter, so her team can pull the strings and rob that. But since you didn't listen to her, she got all of you arrested, so you could all be in jail. And they can rob everything without you all being a distraction to her organization. Believe me, Franklin, just think. What will I even get by lying to you? No, no, Lamar, I just can't. I just can't believe you. Me and my heart believes in mine. She joined the cops. So we stop all this and start leaving a better life. Franklin, my homie, I know this is hard, but this is the harsh reality. She could do all of this because she never loved you. You guys never took vows, did you now, Franklin? They ain't you real family. You see, Benjamin ain't even your son. She lied that she got divorced and moved up here in Los Santos. She has never been married. They took up Benjamin from an orphanage when he was too young to understand anything. And they were waiting for the right time. And the right time came. My came to you. You saw her and she saw you and right after some few days the same thing happened. Wherever you go, she followed you. And later one day she said it those three magical words to you. And you just couldn't ignore her by her beautiful grace and you accepted her too. And then she lied about Benjamin. She has a son, but still you accepted them as a family and started living with them in your own house. They targeted you from the get-go, because they wanted you all to fade away. And now, since the cops let you go, I think they will be coming straight for the kill. So I'm just warning you all be careful, watch your back. I will gather up some more until meanwhile. Benjamin, I think he loves you like a real dad, but I can't be sure about my... Don't let your guard down, Franklin. This has really turned Franklin's whole life trajectory. What's gonna happen now? Lamar was right about everything. My she came into my life just like that. I always told my dad, let's get married. But she always changed the subject. She said we will do it when the time is right until the let's just celebrate our love anniversary. She told me to tell everyone that we are married. I thought she really loved me. Benjamin, I thought him as my son. But now I find out that he ain't even my son. Son or no son, Franklin. But you still loved him like a real dad. I think more than that. I'm sure Benjamin loves you the same way. Don't worry, everything will be okay. Let's just get up and fight back like we always used to do. If Maya is behind all of this, then we will get her no matter what. Yeah, that's right. What's gonna happen? Is Maya really like Lamar claimed her to be? Looks like only time can tell. So this is it for today, guys. Thanks for watching. Please like, share, and subscribe. And I will see you all later in my next video. Until then, goodbye, peace, relax, and have fun.
Whatever Lamar said is that for real. How could I have been so blind amazed to see? I can't help but to think. I knew I goddamn knew that Benjamin wasn't my kid, but I did not know that he wasn't even May's child. Really did she really pick Benjamin up from an orphanage? Is she really have been playing with my feelings all this time? Is she really betraying me behind my back? Don't tell me she's gonna stab me in the back when the time comes. Whatever Lamar said sure had a point. She joined the cops just for her evil organization, but then she lied to me, telling it was for us, so we could leave all this criminal life behind. I don't know what's their motive, but I will figure a way out of this. But first, I need to question Maya about all this. I need to get to the bottom of the situation. Franklin, what are you doing? Why are you just whacking off and wasting your time? Can't you at least do something which is worth off at least at once in your life? Yeah, yeah, whatever. Just stop lecturing me. Why we need to have a talk. I gotta talk to you about something. Can't this wait until tomorrow? Cause unlike you, I just ain't sitting on my ass and doing nothing. I got work to do. Yep, that's right. Your big work, we need to have a talk about that right now. This can't wait any more longer. Is that so, huh? Okay then, tell me, what do you want to talk about my work? You don't like me as an officer. You want me to quit my job as a cop. Come on, let me hear you say it. Hey, what's up, Mom and Dad? You guys okay? Benjamin, go upstairs. This is something you wouldn't be interested on. I gotta have a chat with your mom all alone. Okay, okay, Dad. Eat Lisa, Dad spoke to me nicely after all this time. Looks like everything is going back to normal. Which is really great. Why did you marry me? Why tell me to deceive everyone into believing that we are a family? You see, I had no problem marrying you and accepting you as my wife and Benjamin as my child. But whenever I bought this up, you either changed the subject or just said you weren't interested. But back then, things were going smoothly, so I didn't mind. Benjamin isn't my kid, you knew it, and I knew that too. But I took care and gave him the love he deserved. Just like a real dad. We could have just made the vows and made each other our life partners. But every time you reject it, why is that my why is that? I have been tired of hiding this from everyone. Why, you city Franklin. My son Benjamin and me, we have been betrayed once by the man that I loved. He left us all alone one day and never came back. Benjamin was a little to understand what? all that. No and way, that no is way. when we moved on from that place. And later I found you. You took us in and made us your family. I love you from my heart, Franklin. But I have a feeling the same could happen again with us. So that's the reason why I didn't marry you or didn't want to get in any physical relationship. Yeah, well, that's just straight up bullshit. You are lying to the skin of your teeth. Mine. Benjamin, you ain't your kid, nor you are his real mom. You picked him from an orphanage you were never married. No one has betrayed you. Stop lying. You're the one who's betraying me. Wow, I mean just wow. Looks like you have lost your damn mind. What has gotten into you, Franklin? Just snap out of it. Where did you even come up with this story, huh? Who filled you up with this garbage? Benjamin isn't my son. Are you freaking kidding me? Oh, wait a minute. I know what you are doing. You are just framing me. No, I'm not framing you. You are what I said you are. And heck, you said you joined the cops for us. Well, heck, you joined the cops for us because of your evil organization organization that you have been working for. What the hell is going on? I thought things were going back to normal. But Fifi, this really hit me hard. My dad isn't my real dad, nor my mom as well. Then who am I? Did they really pick me up from an orphanage? No, 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 I don't believe this. I should have not heard their conversation. Damn, 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 this sucks. I hate this freaking so much. I need some alone time to figure a way out of this all. So I can fix everything up and we can go back to the family that we were used to be. Oh my God, Franklin. I can't believe you first, my son, and now an organization. You really are framing me. I'm gonna need a lot of help. Uh, this sucks. Uncle Mike and Trev, they ain't gonna help me either. Not by a long shot. I better relax and think this through. Why did I even overhear their conversation? Mom was admitting that she is my real mom, but Daddy ain't admitted that. Mom knew this from the get-go, but she never told me this once. Dad or no Dad, I still love him like I always did. I'm gonna fix this mess and then I'm sure things will go back to normal. I think I should take a little help from Big Bro Lamar. Oh, what the? Hey, 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 who are you? Ah, just let me go, let me go. Please, please, please. Ah. All right, got him. Now boss is going to be happy. Oh no man, no what the? What is going on? It looks like someone has kidnapped Benjamin. But why? Why kidnap a little kid? What's the meaning of this? Who's behind this anyway? I don't think Franklin knows about this or neither am I. Looks like we will have to wait and find that out. I'm done with your bullshit. I ain't gonna fall for any lie of yours. I don't know how, but I will gather some proof and make you guilty. Just you wait and watch. You are not gonna get away with this, my. You are not gonna get away with this. Well, who's calling now? 
My, it's about time. Get here, yes, Sabi, I'm waiting. You know where to find me. Um, okay, I'm on my way. Okay, it's Lamar, maybe he's got some lead. Hey, Frank, I got a very important intel about Mai. Those organization that I mentioned, they're gonna have an important meeting today. And guess what, Mai is gonna join them too. I guess this is our chance. Tell me, is my home? Yeah, she is. Just hold for a minute, I'm sure she will leave in a matter of moments. And when she does, you better follow that witch's ass. She will fall right in the trap. And yeah, don't worry, I'm Mikey and Trevor are all here waiting for you. Right at their meeting spot. Okie dokie, at last got some intel, I better follow her. It's now or never, I'm Michael, Trevor, and Lamar will all end this together. Here she comes, that witch! I can't believe the snake she is. She has been betraying me around from the get-go. All those sweet smiles off her sure got me. But not anymore, my eyes have opened. And now I can see the witch she is. This really has turned into a mess. Benjamin has been kidnapped, and on the other hand, Omar has finally got some intel about Maya and their evil organization. Is this all somehow connected to each other? Looks like we will have to wait and find out the answer to this. Keep watching you all. I better stay behind or I will get caught. Yeah, this distance is good. She says she is working for the cops. She says she is doing this for our family. Everything she said was just a big lie. I don't know the motive, but I will get to the bottom of this for sure. All right, I saw her getting right at this construction site. Okay, okay, I see a bike. I guess she is in that. Where Lamar and everyone else? He said he would be right here. But I don't see him anywhere around. Neither neither Michael or nor Trevor. Should I call and wait for him? No, this is the enemy's territory. I gotta keep it silent. Keep it cool or I will get caught. I still don't know what Lamar said was the truth or not. But just one way to find this out, and that is to get in and see it for ourselves. I just hope whatever Lamar said to be a lie, because I just can't see my wife betraying me. I love to be with Benjamin and my ass a part of my family. But oh damn, looks like Lamar is saying the truth after all. Man, this sucks. Am I that witch? She, she, she has really betrayed me and my trust. I can see her over there, relaxing and hanging around with all these goons. I need to confront her and end this once and for all. But first, let's take out all these goons one by one. Yeah, go down, you prick. You guys are doomed, no one's gonna save you now. All right, one, done few more to go. Gotta keep it cool, let them not see me. I will assassinate and stealth kill them all. I got this. Let's go. Here we go. There you go. Look at that. You got this, Franklin. You got this. Come on, Franklin. Come on. Nice and slow, Franklin, nice and slow. Bad yeah. Down! Stay there! Hey, get up! Sorry. Okay, well. Shit, I dealt with you. Sorry about that. I'm almost there to the three remaining, and then I will finally get my hands on that soul last month. I'll there you go. See you. Sorry. Oh, you're kidding me. Fuck. No! No! Ah, shit, he's heading right over here. Gotta stay calm and knock him down. Easy, Franklin, easy. You have done this before. And here he comes, bam, bam, bam. Right. Stay down! Stay the fuck fight, down! Bro. Yep, almost done. He is the last one remaining. And then I will finally confront that witch. Fuck all you punk! Okay, okay, yeah, that's enough. Stop knocking off. my men down, Franklin. They know you are here. Well, anyway, kudos, kudos to you for making your way till here. Clap for yourself. You did an excellent job. You knocked all my men down. Does that make you feel good, huh? I can't believe how much of a fool you are. Walking right into the trap. I knew you were following me. The only reason you got till here is because I let you. Do you know why? Because we ourselves will enjoy killing Kill you. Kill me, are you freaking kidding me? I loved you, Ma, I loved you, but seeing this side of you really makes me sick. How could I even fall for all that smiles of yours? I thought we were a real family, but it looks like I was the only one thinking that you pretended to be my wife for a whole one and a half year. Why, what's your objective, you bitch? I just wish I had the strength to kill you with my bare hands. But no, I can't do that to the people who I used to love. You know what, I'm gonna tell this to the cops. How much of a corrupt human you really are. Well, you think you can leave this bliss that easy? Then think again, Franklin. I have knocked all your mans down. They can't stop me and neither can you. Oh, shit. What the fuck? Hey, what? what Dad, the... Dad, please, please, please help me. <laughs> Isn't that just wonderful? <laughs> oh, of course it is. Hey, guys, move aside. Let Franklin meet the evil organization's boss. 
Well, hello there, Franklin homie. So how are you doing? A beautiful, great family reunion, don't you think? Lamar, you evil bastard, so you were behind this, huh? So Maya is working for you? You are the one leading this evil organization. Damn you, damn you, how could you both do this to me? And what about Michael and Trevor, where are they? Don't tell me you have done something to them as well. Where are they just letting them all go let Benjamin, Michael, and Trevor go? You want me right, you can have me. Oh, Franklin, you still care about Benjamin even though he isn't your own kid. That really, really fills my heart. What has gotten into you, big bro, Lamar? I considered you as my big bro. We have shared so many memories together. So why do all this? <laughs> I do all this so well, a good question indeed. You see, I always wanted to be the number one of Los Santos. I tried stopping your so-called dad and his friends many times. By making them arrested! Heck, I even let my get into Franklin's life so he could stop all that. But every time, they had to ruin it. They always had to be the first to steal everything! And it really made my stomach sick. He used to roll with me as my homie. But as soon as he joined those pricks Michael and Trevor, he just left me in the dust. And now if I kill them and put them aside, then no one's gonna stop me to achieve my dream of number one. How could I be so blind to all of this? You guys were stabbing me right in my back since the start. Damn, all those sweet talks and smiles really got me. But not anymore, because I now know the bitch Myers and the bastard that you are. Damn, if you wouldn't have gotten a hold of Benjamin, then I would have killed you both right here and now with my own hands. <laughs> I would have killed you with my own hands. Just shut up, would you? Don't get ahead of yourself. And yes, you are a fool, because you couldn't deny me even in your wildest dreams. So we just played right along with your life, Franklin. All those hugs, the kiss we shared, and the memories, that really doesn't mean anything to me. My goal was just to trap you in. And I successfully did that. And yeah, don't worry, we still haven't got a hold of your friends. But I assure you, we will get them when we are done with you and Benjamin, my so-called son. <laughs> Ah, uh, yeah, that's right. Get over here, baby. You really played your role well. By getting into his life and making him trust you more than anything. You sure deserve an award for that, baby. I'm really, really proud of you. Mom, is this really who you are? Come on, snap out of it. I know that the old Maya is still in there. This can't be real right, Mom. Please stop this. Let's all go back to the family that we used to be. Uh, just shut up. I can't believe this kid. He is still calling me his mom. Family, you say? Hey, kid, I was never your mom. I was just playing my role to the finest. The only family I got is Lamar and all of them who has surrounded you. Ain't that right, my love, Lamar? Of course, of course, baby. <laughs> and now we are gonna enjoy killing you guys. First, it's you and then him and then it's Michael and Trevor's turn. <laughs> hey, no one's gonna stop me. Oh, this has really turned Franklin's life upside down. What's gonna happen next in this story? Will Lamar really kill Franklin and Benjamin? Or will they be saved? Only time can tell. So this is it for today, guys. Thanks for watching. Please like, share, and subscribe, and I will see you all later in my next video. Until then, bye, peace, relax, and have fun. I trusted you with my life, and this is how you are gonna repay me. I thought we were an unbreakable bond. Families for life, but you played me like a damn fool. All the kisses we shared, all the romantic things between us. Was that all a lie to her, my? You even bought Benjamin into this. How could you do this to us? Lamar, just shut the hell up, you son of a bitch! You are laughs are really making me sick. I thought you'd be my homie. Never in a million years I thought you would be a backstabbing prick. But you better remember this. As soon as I get out of here, I'm coming straight for your goddamn hands. Mom, please, please! Just let's us go back to the family that we used to be. Let's end this bullshit, please, Mom, please! I'm sorry, but that can never happen again, Benjamin. My so-called wife and your so-called mom, she has ruined everything. It is what it is. It was never about you, Franklin and Benjamin. <laughs> Oh, just look at them all crying and whining. Isn't that cute? Franklin, all the things between us that never really mattered to me. I did what I did. I was just making a fool out of you. You were just a means to an end. So you could believe me. Accept it. You are never gonna make it out of here alive. Accept my ass, you bitch. Why, you are nothing but a lying, cheating bitch. Keep talking. Keep running your mouth. Because nothing's gonna change. Mom, mom. What are you doing? Just shut up. Don't you dare call me your mom. That was all an act for bigger and better things. <laughs> well, wasn't that nice? But oh my, don't just kill them yet, baby. We got a long way to go with them. You know what I mean, right? Just pulling the trigger and ending them, that won't be fun. Let's enjoy and savor this moment, shall we? Yeah, sure thing, Lamar. Do as you see fit with them. They really are making me sick by running their mouths. We'll let them have at it. Don't get concerned by their stupid things. You know, Franklin, I waited for this day for a long time, and it has finally come. So I won't just end this quick. I'm gonna make the most of it. <laughs> I'm gonna take my time easy and slow. And I'm gonna enjoy torturing you both until you're dead.
This way it would be more fun, isn't that right, Mai? Um, yeah, I like the sound of that. Well then, let's get it on. So who should be the first? Franklin, how about you, huh? I just can't wait to hear you scream. Ah! Or should it be your fake son first, huh? Yeah, 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 I think I should do this to Benjamin. Benjamin or Franklin, who should be the first? Franklin, you see me, Benjamin, you see me. Anyone, anyone? Well, screw it, ha, 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 I'm gonna have fun with you both. Stop it, you psycho! Just let us go, let us go! You got scared, didn't you, Franklin? I can see the look in your eyes. The fear of torture, death. Oh, man, this is the best day of my life. Ha, 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 Lamar, you prick, and my you bitch! When I get out of here, you are gonna wish that you never crossed me. Just hang on for a while, I'm sh- is that he loves me just like a real one that you know nothing about. Well said, Benjamin. Well said. Thankfully, Trevor and Michael are here to save Franklin and Benjamin. Let's hope they get the job done and make that bastard Lamar and my pay for their actions. Keep watching, you guys. Let's see how this story unfolds. Hey, Mike, I will take the right one. You go for the left. I don't like to knock down women's, but if this has come to this, then my sorry, sweetheart. Yeah, go down easy, easy. There you go. I got this. Let's go, let's go! Well done, T, my man. Just a few more to go. All right, you're going down. Yeah, nice and slow, here we go. Oh yeah, good night. Happy now? Ah, uh, crap, I'm too close. I better hide myself. What? What the hell, what was that sound? They're all down, all right. I know what's going on. Come on out, Michael, and Trevor, stop hiding yourself. You can't stealth knock us all. Stop hiding and bring your ass out. Or I swear, I'm gonna shoot the brains out of Franklin and Benjamin. Come on, reveal yourself. Yeah, okay, you got us. You can calm the hell down. There you are. Oh, I got you. The brave heroes, Michael, and Trevor are here to save their friends. Isn't that nice? But by coming here, you, you sure dig a grave for yourself. Now I'm gonna kill you all together just like how I wanted. Yeah, well, I ain't gonna let that happen not on my watch. Come on, guns down, Lamar, my and the other goons. Or I swear to God, none of us will be leaving out here alive. Yeah, just do as we say or else, you know me, I won't hesitate pulling this trigger on you. Just let Benjamin and Franklin go now. <laughs> Are you freaking kidding me, man? All these cards belong to me. I have played my cards perfectly and you all have fallen right into the trap. You can't scare me with your crazy talks. You got nothing on me. And me, I got these praise. And let me tell if you get one step closer then I won't hesitate to pull in the trigger on them. We are more in numbers, you two can do nothing. Just put your gun down and be held captive. And die alongside with this fools. It was a matter of time we would have come for your heads, but it's nice you came along. You have really made our work easy. Ha <laughs> yeah, that's right, that's right. Yeah, yeah, yeah. You talk a lot about numbers game, don't you? Well, we have not come alone, my friends. We got numbers too, and that to a big one. They might be here any time now. They have surrounded this place. You got no escape, bud. It's best you give up now. Yeah, all right. Finally, some more backup. Let's hope that Lamar, Maya, and their goons give up now. Let's see what's going to happen next in this story. All right, everyone stay where you are. It's the LSPD. Don't move a muscle. Everyone, guns down now. I said guns down. We have surrounded you from every corner. You can't escape. So it's best you give up this bullshit and let the captives go. Why, I never expected this from you. I never knew you were this corrupt, but you know what hates me the most. It's me because I signed you up for an officer duty, but I'm gonna stop this now. You have spoiled that officer's uniform as it is, but I won't let you do it any more further. This ends now, mine. Like I said, you all were just a means to 
an end. Nothing more than that. Well, suck it, you pricks. Hey, you do take care of Franklin and his kid. I will take care of the rest. Oh, God, no. Oh, please, no. What the hell? Lamar, Lamar, what are you doing? Just let me go. Just shut up, bitch, or I will shoot the life out of you. What are you talking about? What in the world? I thought they were together. The whole trajectory has been changed. What should we do now? Lamar, please let me go. What are you doing? We are together. We are couples. Have I done something wrong? If it's that, then I apologize. Oh! Let's sort this out later when Just we are done go, with all of it. Just let her go, you bastard. How could you do that to her, you evil heart? What the? What the no, Ma, fuck? you haven't done anything wrong. Fuck? You played all your cards perfectly. Then why do this? Why, why, why? Why, well, you ask. Because I what never the, loved you, Ma, that's fuck? why. Just like how you used Franklin and Benjamin, oh, I used shit. you. You were a means to it, and just like them. I used you so I could get all the work done. I was playing and fooling you all the time. You just couldn't realize it because of your bullshit love towards me. Once I would have get rid of Franklin, Michael, and Trevor. The next on my list was you. It looks like I will have to do this all together. If I ain't leaving, neither are they. Lamar, this is... A joke, right? Please just tell me that this not the truth. This is the goddamn truth. As you know me, I will do anything to achieve my goals. Even if it means killing you all. And let me tell you, I have killed a lot of ladies who were near and dear to me till getting here. They were all just a pawn just like mine. So I won't hold back and bang in her head. Too. No, so just, no, no! <laughs> don't you do that! Hey, you piece of shit! Can't you hear me? Stay where you are. Don't Stop, get one please. step closer. I'll fuck you. I will don't shoot do the hell out of her now. She's dead. That's a that's a serves. You right, Lamar? Now oh, I can die Oh God! Please no! Damn it! They both shot each other down. Lamar, you make me sick. I wish I would have never met you along the way, but I shall not you remember sure you now. Oh, Goodbye, God. you prick. This is as far as you go. No, Mom! No, please don't go! Please don't leave us! Please keep your eyes open! Don't die on us, please, Mom, please! It's okay, son. I was never your mom from the first place, but thank you for still calling me mom. No, you are my mom and you forever will be. I don't care if what anyone says! Benjamin, Franklin, I'm sorry. Sorry for stabbing you in the back. I never knew how that felt until now. If somewhere in your heart you still got something for me, then please, please forgive me. We forgive, we forgive you, my. At the end, you realized it and did the right thing. You shot him down the one way or another. You saved us, my. We are really grateful for you. Now, please keep your eyes open no, until Franklin, we get some help. No, Franklin, no. I won't make it. Just hear me out before I leave this place for good. You and Benjamin have still a lot of time ahead of you. Please find some other girl who can replace me, marry her, make a good family, and please take care of Benjamin and make him a fine gentleman. No, no, Mom, no, please oh, wake no, up. Man, you can't no. leave us. Please wake up, wake up. I need you, Mom, Dad needs you. Please open your eyes. Come on, stop joking. Open your eyes. Mom, please. Benjamin, it's no use she is gone. It won't bring her back. Please calm down, Benjamin. Let's give her the funeral that she deserves. Everything is going to be okay, kid. We are all with you. Calm down, Benjamin, and you do Franklin. Benjamin, calm down. Didn't you hear your mom? She wanted us to be happy. So let's give her the goodbye just like how she wanted. Oh, oh, oh okay, Dad. I betrayed them, but at last she did the right thing. Well, so this is it for today, guys. The end of chapter. Thanks for watching. Please like, share, and subscribe. And I will see you all later in my next video.